<laughs> oh, jeez. Goodness gracious. Can we show this? Is this... Is this okay? I think it's okay. Okay. Glazed donuts, twisty donuts, jelly donuts, cream-filled donut holes, malasadas! Okay. This sounds pornographic. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Doesn't sound like gurn gurn to me. Sounds like crickets or something. Sounds like it's coming from the bathhouse. Definitely not a place Dones would hang out. <laughs> Could they be steaming Dones in there? <laughs> Is someone there? <gasps> what the f What the fuck? <laughs> oh. Oh crap. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what? What? I don't- what just happened? Was that Shihiro's face? It sounds like this is where the committee chairman needs to get things going with a bang! <laughs> it's time like these we needed to learn to love again! <laughs> Impossible. Or not. Oh, he's still traumatized from his friend being electrocuted. Yeah, he's to not death. doing he's not doing great. Okay, well anyway, <laughs> since Tag is like catatonic. <laughs> as the oldest one here, what how do you how do you know that? I'm officially stepping up to take the lead. I'm 74. <laughs> how come Toko gets like two um world's ultimates, you know? It's like selfish. <laughs> world's ultimate writing prodigy and world's ultimate murder scissors prodigy. Did can you really not say the word prodigy? What are you talking about? <laughs> Just go ahead and say your line. I'm bud. just a fire starter, man. A twisted fire starter. Right. <laughs> yes. Yeah, song by the band Prodigy. <laughs> Prodigy? God! Damn it. <laughs> if she weren't here, my chances of survival would go up at least 10%. Might as well kill her. To 10. <laughs> <laughs> and look at this. A wall. <laughs> <laughs> they have even provided us with a remarkable number of magazines. Isn't it wonderful? Those will certainly be helpful in keeping our boredom at bay. <laughs> See, this place is the best! <laughs> we have 12 magazines to last years! Wow! And this one's dated 1975. Very recent. Table. There's a table. <laughs> is that a picture of Mondo? I think it's Mondo and Leon. Yeah, it is. Something on the floor. It looks like a picture. But as I stretched my hand out to pick it up, almost as if on its own, my hand froze. It's all our dead friends! It's less like a classroom and more like some kind of research institute. Hey, what's up, Taka? You snapped Something out like of this yet? could blow up the world. <laughs> yeah, sure would be bad if there was a catatonic, emotionally disturbed person in the room <laughs> near it. Hey, Taka, don't you think this place is like some kind of research institute, like I was saying earlier? <laughs> Still no oh, reaction. Crap. Hey Taka, what would happen if I peed in your mouth? Yeah. No reaction. Hey <laughs> Taka, do you like burritos? <laughs> no? Nothing? <laughs> I like that one! Oh crap. Yeah. <laughs> this seems like a good situation to be in. Yeah. It's super- Oh good, a small enclosed space with the psycho killer. <laughs> Keskase. I wear my shirt open. <laughs> So you see my chest, girl. <laughs> Jeez, your knockers are huge. What the knockers. heck? Did you convince them to double up on milk production? Bastard! What the fuck? Then we should talk about what we found, right, Taka? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's doing really well these days. <laughs> right. <laughs> Oh, cool, man. Wow, that was, that was, we really learned a lot in that scene. Yeah, that, that was one of my favorite multi-person exchanges in this mm -hmm. game. It's about the nurse's office, remember? There's one on the first floor, right? Well, I remember, but it's locked. Yeah. Nope, not locked. So then. Did you find any protein in there? <laughs> or even vitamins? That's a very like personal question. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did you get any protein out of it? Um... <laughs> I did look, but no dice. But I did find protein! <laughs> <laughs> and, by the way, because you brought up goldfish, here's my goldfish impression. <laughs> <laughs> it's a super rare prize that was given away at a bingo contest at a big anime convention. You have any idea how much I had to pay that guy to get my hands on it? Wait! 
That's my camera! What? Where did you find it? Oh, uh, my ass! <laughs> In the physics lab. <laughs> How did it get there? <laughs> but if it wasn't taken before we got here or after we got here... I bet they're all still alive. They left the school and then took that picture. Is that right? Remember when we watched Leon get pummeled by a thousand <laughs> baseballs? <laughs> he must have survived it. Yeah. It's right. But more importantly, let's shut up. On another topic, <laughs> there's something that has been bothering me. I would like to discuss that. It smells like shit in here. <laughs> wow. So it's like rock dog shit. <laughs> Which one? Okay. I don't know where that got me. There's okay. Something that's been bothering me. What's bothering you, Celeste? Actually. The dog shit I mentioned. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking smells. It's been here. Alright. I saw it. So what? A ghost? <laughs> A ghost? You mean like that ghost? Patrick Swayze? Oh, yeah, what Did fuck? he make pottery? <laughs> oh my god, I was in the art room! <laughs> <laughs> so it happened last night. I saw a ghost at the end. I was in bed, but I couldn't get to sleep. And and we weren't sure if we should censor this or not. So I guess we'll figure I it out I was looking later. extra hot. <laughs> yeah. Just setting the scene. <laughs> <laughs> I just kept thinking about everything that's happened up till now. I ended up just getting more upset. And I was like, that is a wildly more suggestive picture than anything else in this game. Yeah, that really, it like shifts, it's like, whoa, hold on, what kind of game is this? Yeah. So to try and cheer myself up, I thought I'd go get some dones. <laughs> Did we slip into waifu horror? <laughs> <laughs> it's you. Oh, uh, donuts again? And you ignored the rule regarding nighttime. I know, sorry, I feel really bad about that, but seriously, dones. Anyway. Maybe we can focus on the fucking ghost I saw! <laughs> yeah, anyway, please continue. Yes, I will continue. Where was it you saw Chihiro's ghost? It's probably the important question we should be asking. Well... Well, I heard a sound, and when I opened the locker, I saw a kind of pale outline of Chihiro, and then I pooped, and then I pooped a little. <laughs> <laughs> I would bet that Chihiro fixed it. After all, she was known as the ultimate programmer. Which, which also translates to ultimate IT professional? Then perhaps... Great point. More importantly, Hina, you said you saw a green light, yes? Surely you did not mistake the light of the monitor for a ghost. Uh... <laughs> so I pooped for nothing! <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm surprised you were able to dress yourself in the morning. I know, I was covered in poop! Don't be mean, I was just trying to make you feel better. What if I get all depressed forever now? <laughs> oh man, I love Hero. But listen, isn't this really strange? What's this laptop doing in here? I mean, let's get back to the point without meandering for fucking 30 minutes about nothing in particular. It's just like Kyoko said, the display isn't on, but the laptop definitely has power. In a detailed manner. <laughs> so first of all, we have to wake it up. Get Hello, on! Mr. Computer! <laughs> she moved the cursor over the alter ego icon, and then she double-clicked it. She put a heart on your page. Heart, heart on your page. <laughs> the screen suddenly She's went. making it Facebook official! <laughs> I knew the chances that Master would survive this situation were very low. So, I was prepared for this moment. <laughs> it's like... Printing out death certificate. Yeah, just because you demand something doesn't mean we have to do it except for all of the things that you've ever demanded of us. Yeah, like the demand that we all have to stay here and kill each other. <laughs> yes. Do it? You mean like, do it, do it? Wait, what? What do you mean, do it, do it? Ew, gross, you said do it. <laughs> yes. What are you, 12? Dang, that murderous, <laughs> horny bear. <laughs> yeah. Should I sneak into the bathhouse like Monokuma said? Or just go quietly back to the dining hall. No, I can't do it! I can't treat the girls like that! Let's just head back to the dining hall. What? I'm blubbing! You have a choice, it's not like we're in a visual novel! Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> but what about your man's fantasy? I'm not, I'm not sure a real man's fantasy should be about spying on girls and stuff. It should be more about your hopes, or your dreams of adventure, or whatever. But anyway, I'm not gonna- Wow, carve that into a rock. <laughs> <laughs> to be kept waiting by the likes of you. 
Rest assured, if we had access to firearms, you'd all be dead. But then so would I, because he would know that I was black and whatever. Damn. Okay. I've prepared this graduation present for whichever lucky student makes it out of here alive. Oh, sick. That's cool. What do you think? It's 10 million bucks. 10 million smackaroos. They just it's immediately like turn to each other and kill him. Yeah. There's no way we'd kill each other for money. Right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys? <laughs> Everyone's gone. <laughs> She's right, you, you can't simply person, purchase the person's life. Uh, um. You can say 10 million or however much. I don't give a crap for serious. Yeah, they're all right. Whether it's 10 million or any other amount of money. 11 million. I'll kill you all! <laughs> <laughs> you can't judge others by your own standard. Yeah, there might be someone here who's having money problems, not me, I, I, not, but someone someone else. <laughs> there might be someone who wants to have a, a transplant which would give them bigger hands. <laughs> In that, For instance, <laughs> that surgery might cost a, a cool ten million dollars and <laughs> <laughs> five million per hand. <laughs> Can I get this fucking, like, like, embroidered on my wall? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Good job, Aaron. Yeah, he, he, he just put Aaron Hansen's name over Hifumi Yamada. And, and screenshot away, everyone. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's everyone just head back to our rooms. I'll miss whoever of you doesn't make it back tomorrow. And don't think about that whole money thing. Got it? Good. Then let's break. I'm about to... How was that? Pretty good, right, Taka? <laughs> right. Okay, I actually I think I really like traumatized Taka. I mean they're <laughs> they're definitely playing it for laughs. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it, the, the the comedy timing is really funny. Hey, morning, Makoto. Good morning. You're kind of sweaty. Have you been <laughs> Wow, smooth. Yeah. No, I'm just disgusting naturally. Okay, then we can do something in the rec room. I'm not good at much, but I do know how to play Othello. I'm not very good at that either, though. I don't like to think what I'm playing, so... Oh, she's cute. Aww. Could, yeah, could she be your romantic interest now that your first romantic interest is dead? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ah, good morning. Morning. Actually, it's a great morning. A morning that has blessed my entire future. Oh, really? I already hate this conversation. <laughs> Oh, how quickly can I disengage? Really? <laughs> I would have thought that would be obvious. Why do we need to make a rule about it? Wow. That's a good question. That's a good question. We may be able Why to locate did I... another energy emission in the radar room. <laughs> when we what? find that media, we'll find Dr. Wari. <laughs> the free time. I'm gonna go to the store. <laughs> Where's the store at? Where's the store? Where's... Where's that confounded store? <laughs> oh, there it is. Where's the store? Tell me about these stores. <laughs> They're huge. This store's for you. <laughs> I got a sweet bag of gums over here! I'm shocked because I looked over at the Discord to see your face. You are fucking stressing about giving her the right present. <laughs> well, I want to make. I could, sure. I could see you like pulling at your beard, like, oh, I don't know. Shut up! I think I like Sakura. Okay, I think she's cool. I know that. I'm saying it's cute. In mixed martial arts, speed, agility, and endurance are all necessary parts of total body coordination. If that's your goal, you can't just focus on one aspect of your training. For example, kipping pull-ups can train one area, while power training equipment works multiple areas. Are you listening? Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, yeah. yeah absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Are you listening? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I got it. Oh, ding dong. Sounds like someone's here. Oh, man, I was just about to pitch loaves. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> <laughs> So you're just gonna stand there, huh? Just wait for things to get better? Just take your time and get all depressed. Take the time to indulge your regrets. 
You might even start walking again without realizing it. Sure, that kind of mediocre thinking might work for some people. <laughs> what if I said it with a uh, kind of condescending tone? <laughs> this is weird. Yeah. <laughs> Taka? Oh, oh dear. jeez. Things are getting weird. It's starting to sink in! The way a bucket full of water sinks into a bone-dry sponge. Huh? Those words, deep within my heart. They're inside of me! Whoa! Oh, my oh man, he's got Super Saiyan! Yeah, dude! Taka! <laughs> Who the fudge is Taka?! Chaos Control?! He snuck into the dressing room in the middle of the night and accessed Alter Ego without permission. And when I caught him last night, I killed him. <laughs> he was hugging the laptop and breathing strangely. What are you doing? I thought I made myself clear yesterday, but since being subtle didn't work, it looks like I'm going to have to kill you. But I think I have a pretty good idea of what Fumi's been getting up to. Oh, he's been looking at internet porn. It's a Brazzers! <laughs> um, if... <laughs> <laughs> I happened to do a psychic reading for, for for a certain famous CEO once. And that guy was seriously head over heels for a mannequin. He had a wedding and everything. His name was Jeff Bezos. And like, um, um, like immediately the game shuts down. Don Ropa has been hit with a lawsuit. <laughs> I found myself, you know, liking her. Her face, her personality, her voice, even her keyboard. Even her keyboard? This is getting really weird. Even the wow. keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Aaron. <laughs> I think you have misunderstood the situation, Hifumi. <laughs> I'm Celeste now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna stick a banana up your tailpipe. Oh, dude, he's a please, fusion. Please don't. What the what the heck kind of fusion is this? Hell yeah. What does fusion mean? Oh, like, uh, like in Dragon Ball. Like, fusion, huh? And then uh, they become oh. Gogeta instead of Vegeta and Goku. I see. I've Gogeta. never really watched Dragon Ball. Well, you're really missing out, Dan. And honestly, yeah. I'm actually embarrassed for you to say that out loud. Okay. Mm-hmm. Cool. You just strip down to your waist, then take a dry towel and start rubbing down your bare skin. I call it... I call it, uh... Huh? What am I calling again? A way to keep healthy by stripping down and rubbing a towel across your skin. Let's take a shot at this. Uh... Towel treatment? Yeah, I mean... Sure. <laughs> Is it something like towel treatment? You got it! Oh my god, yeah, that's it! Oh, sick. <laughs> wow, alright, I picked the one with the word towel in it. <laughs> I love going out of, my, out of my apartment balcony, stripping down, feeling the wind on my skin. God, it feels so amazing! I never let a morning pass without getting a good rub down! Jesus Boy, Christ. they are really just like... <laughs> just, just... Picture it all with your mind, because we're not going to show you anything. Yeah. I wish I could kiss each and every one of you, but I can't, because there is a... Uh, a, a reunion tour going on that... Is just preventing all of that. You shouldn't kiss anybody. What, never? Yeah, ever. Like, not my wife, <laughs> or...? <laughs> no! <laughs> Are you trying to get us all killed? <laughs> Stop <the> kissing! <laughs> Happy New Day! I'm the kind of guy I don't want to celebrate a new year. I want to celebrate the dawn of every new day! Because every new day deserves celebrating, once so... Again. Once again, Happy New Day! <laughs> oh, thank you, Robot Bear. I had the most inspiring dream last night. <laughs> <laughs> The guy trying to kill us said, have a good day. <laughs> Don't put me on the same level as that, that virgin. I might catch his virginity. Yeah. <laughs> nah, my guess is you're already infected. Like a virgin Taka and the Chad Hifumi. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your melons. They're seriously gargantuan. Do you dunk them in milk every night or something? <laughs> Starting? But isn't this a democracy? Or would you exclude those who don't fit into your tyrannical majority? That's not what we're doing. What the fuck are you talking about? Well, whatever. If nothing else, tell me what's going on with Taka. When I saw him yesterday, I happened to notice something seemed off. So I was curious. Oh, off? Is it that his <laughs> eyes were flaming? 
and his hair had turned from black to white. Becca has become utterly useless and also really hot. Celeste, you don't have to say it like that. Did his spirit collapse or something? Was he unable to withstand this environment? No, he went super saiyan. Those men who clothe themselves in the cheap fabric of justice are often the first to fall. Wow, so, so deep. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> Jesus Christ! I joined Kyoko while she searched the school. We didn't say anything to each other. Cool. I had a really great time today. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Oh, let's hang out with Toko! <laughs> oh, God, please, no. <laughs> I don't give a toot about you! <laughs> Where's Natsuko? Wow. Tell me or I'll kill you! Mm, it's a really good idea to hang out with Genocide Jack. Fuck yeah. You can help me track down master! This is awesome. Great! It's a bomb disguised as a prison! You're working with everyone else to try and kill me! Well, allow me to return the favor, you bastard! I think oh, I made crap. her mad. She probably thinks worse of me now. Well, well that didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Alright, well, I guess you'll never be friends with the crazy murderer. Yeah. Uh -oh. Time to comfortably sleep at night. Fundamental circumstances are becoming clear. If it wasn't the mastermind, and it wasn't Taka or Hufumi, then quite simply, it was someone else. Oh, amazing detective work! <laughs> this guy sucks! Mak Makoto, Celeste, Sakura, Hina, Toko, or myself. One of us must be the thief. Thanks, genius. Murder is a word whose definition changes with time, with place, and with society! If murder is evidence of abnormality, then all of history's greatest heroes must have been abnormal. The Some that people forgive are way more abnormal than the ones they don't. Damn, so true. Wow. Yo, Monokuma. Monokuma is like really making me think about life, man. <laughs> Ding dong, Yo, It's like, is he Monokuma or is he like Nietzsche, right? Right? <sighs> <laughs> Nobody in here. I mean, maybe I should just look on the. Whoa! Oh, crap. Someone come here! What? That was Hina! She's supposed to be checking the third floor! The third floor! There was no time to think. I was running for the stairs before I knew what was happening. I flew up the stairs leading to the third floor. I can fly, so what? Right away, I saw her standing there in the hallway. Big deal! This is the beginning of a new session, and I have been sweating bullets trying to worry about, um... which character is now undoubtedly dead. Yeah. Uh, sweating bullets! <laughs> Hello, me. Um, I'm really hoping it's not Hero, because I don't want to say goodbye to him. I love that dude. Oh no. It could be, though. I know it could be. Of course it could be. I got attacked. Attacked? By who? I'm not sure. Of course. Some sort of strange <laughs> man. Strange man. Was he slender? <laughs> a suspicious person. A suspicious person whose existence is so unusual I can't help but call him strange. Without a doubt, it was some sort of strange, suspicious individual. Could you describe the individual? Yes, <laughs> he was strange. Tell us everything you can remember, Celeste. Be as detailed as you can. Well, I'm glad you asked. He was suspicious <laughs> and strange. What? Strange? Yes, very strange. Well, it all happened earlier this morning. I got a strange feeling that a man was behind me. <laughs> Imagine my surprise when it turned out to be a strange man. I woke up from my early 7 a.m. beef slapping. <laughs> like, she just goes through a day and it's extremely weird. <laughs> yeah, just... I juggled, I, ju I juggled puppies from 8.30 to 9. <laughs> As, I usually As is my do. want. <laughs> it's probably why you hear like, burp, 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 through your door every morning. <laughs> anyway, that was where I first saw the strange man. <laughs> I was speeding oh the wearing of him. He was obviously suspicious. <laughs> <sighs> As previously described, did anything in particular stand out about this strange guy? Well, he yes, I'm glad you asked. He was suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> I was able to photograph the suspicious individual without him realizing it, but the photo came out rather strange. It ha it obviously has the outline of Hero's gigantic hair. Yeah. Who could it be? <laughs> I don't understand. It doesn't look like anybody we know. Oh. What the f- <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
<laughs> Who's more than meets the eye now, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, 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 you too. <laughs> oh, it's Birka. What's going on? What's all the fuss? Are you some kind of Decepticon artist? Oh, God. Genocide Jill. Yay. I really look forward to her dying so we don't have to look at her anymore. Yeah. Oh, damn. Hifumi. That guy was Robo Justice. This Robo Justice you're referring to is this. Is. Is this. Is it not? No, that's not him. <laughs> what we need to do now is get Hifumi to the nurse's office right away. Whatever else we do, he needs to be treated as soon as possible. Yeah, you mean the office where there's no nurse? Yeah. You're right, let's go. Right. We'll put him on a table and then I guess he'll just lay there. After that, yes, thank you for watching it and taking a picture instead of helping me. He dragged me to the library and whack, down came the hammer. That must have been 30 or 40 minutes ago. Take it from me, I was bleeding and unconscious. <laughs> and around 3, 7.30, in other words, we would have still been in the dining hall. Which means Hina, Sakura, and I were together and Kyoko was still with us. So we all have alibis. <sighs> I was in the laundry room, doing my laundry. Alibi, watertight. <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying Kyoko's working with the mastermind? That's not possible. What? <laughs> Because I have a soup's crush on her. Yeah. And no girl I ever liked would try to kill someone. I saw a shadow. Something moving around at the top of the stairs. Really? Uh, Up on the second floor then? You bastard! You want to get away from me? <laughs> we all shot towards the stairs. <laughs> we were all bunked on the head. <laughs> Whoa. Wow, that's a, that's a scream. Yeah. Huh? What was that? That came from downstairs, it must have been... You feel me? He's in the nurse's office! This is bad, come on, we have to go back! What? Boy, that was stupid, what? leaving a defenseless man on a table. With that, we split into two groups. Me, Celeste, and Hina, all were on downstairs to the first floor. He's in the nurse's office, let's go! Uh, half of us... Uh, half of us would be known as the Fellowship of the Ring. <laughs> the other half would go for backup from Gondor. Sorry, please continue. I don't get it. We stormed- Of course you don't. You yeah. gotta see those damn movies. We stormed into the nurse's office with what greeted us was a world of dripping crimson. Or pink. Oh, oh, right, oh, oh. Alright, who's dead? Oh, it's Hifumi. Whoa! Hifumi! Oh, no! Everything was covered in pink. <laughs> yeah, right. And in the center of all this neon highlighter pink was... Hifumi! Oh, man. Oh, jeez. Another character Dan voices down the drain. <laughs> I know, right? I really enjoyed voicing him, too. Yeah. You're not serious, are you? He's not really dead, is he? Uh, Hina. My love. <laughs> God, I don't understand. I don't know how to break this, this no sense. <laughs> It's like the fifth murder. Yeah. I tried to sound confident and upbeat, but I was, I was, I was about to poop. I was about to poop my yeah. pants. <laughs> I had to stop trembling for what I just been through. I looked at the clock, and there were no hands on the clock, <laughs> and I didn't know what time it was. <laughs> I leapt through the doorway, and when I did, I found another nightmare. The second nightmare of the day was waiting for me to greet. It was waiting to greet me. Oh, oh no! Whoa, no shit, Taka! Damn, there is a pool. There, in a pool of his own blood, it was Taka. Dude, no! At this God rate, Dan's not it. gonna voice anybody. <laughs> I know! Like, I'm, I'm officially now an innocent bystander yeah. in this whole playthrough. <laughs> Son of a bitch! I do have to stop getting attached to these people, because uh, yeah. they are dropping like flies. Do you want Look at Toko? his tiny little legs! How do you not love this guy? <laughs> it's, like, it's like an orange being supported by two toothpicks. <laughs> <laughs> do you, do you want to you be Toko? No, I hate her. <laughs> okay, cool. Next time on Game Grounds. <laughs> See you later. Daniel. Oh, wait, hold on. Daniel, Daniel, I'm here. I'm calling to you from another world. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That other world uses 1970s house antennas. <laughs> Hifumi's body discovered in the nurse's office. 
Ntaka's body discovered in the equipment room. I was witness to two nightmares, one right after the other. There was one- The only question was, which was the murderer? <laughs> <laughs> one of them murdered the other, obviously, in different places. No, they were Before weren't. being murdered himself by himself or <laughs> the other one that he murdered. <laughs> yeah. I think I figured it out. We can go to the trial now, right? <laughs> Why is this happening? Wait, what happened to Toko? No, I lost Dan for a second. There he is. Welcome back, Aaron. <laughs> what happened to Toko? Did you see her on the floor, Co? What's that? Toko was passed out on the floor. Toko was? Or... Mm -hmm. That's Taka, and he's dead. <laughs> what would happen, okay? Think of this. Consider this, alright? Mm -hmm. What would happen if the third... What if one of the kids that came in, like ultimate, whatever, what if one of the kids was the ultimate stoner? <laughs> what? Anyway, that's my pitch for, I... for a cartoon. <laughs> Is that suspicious individual responsible for the strange killing of Taka to Taka to? Who am I gonna <laughs> talk to? to? <laughs> are you telling me they faked the funk on the nasty dunk? What are you talking about? It's disappeared. Don't be ridiculous. <laughs> Do you think a murderer would be so low as to dispose of the body later? <laughs> are you serious? What the heck is happening here? It's almost like we're trapped in a school and we're forced to murder each other. Everyone back to the nurse's office. Yeah, there's a lot of like, I can't believe this is happening. Well, I, I can. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this I is day like, seven of this. I feel like the, the, the game really primed us well for, it's for the most believable thing. <laughs> if Pac-Man showed up, that would be hard to believe. I practically leapt down the stairs. Needs <laughs> <laughs> last way to the bathroom. This is this is no time for that story. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I had to take well, well, I'm very proud of you, Hina. All by yourself. Very good. <laughs> First, there were two murders, and now one of the bodies has been taken. What is Taka's body going to be taken too? Shit! Why didn't anyone stay behind? Taken 2, starring Liam Neeson. <laughs> I will find the dead body, and I will kill it. <laughs> then who might the next target be? Toko? Huh? <laughs> Just wishful thinking on Bianca's part. Yeah. I completely forgot she's still unconscious in the equipment room. God, we are terrible at this. Like, absolutely fucking terrible. Calm down. You forgot about her, didn't you? You have no right to blame me. <laughs> Nowadays, everybody want to talk like they got something to say, but nothing comes out when they move their lips. Just a bunch of gibberish and motherfuckers act like they forgot about Dre. <laughs> Didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> and then like, pff, ultimate rapper comes out of screen. <laughs> Togo! Oh, man. Thank God you're we okay. We really gotta stop leaving bodies around. <laughs> yeah. But right away, I noticed there was something very different here. Can you see what was different? <laughs> yeah, I was just thinking do, that. Do, 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 do. Write it down in your handy dandy notebook. Do, 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 you have do, six do. minutes remaining to figure it out. Wait, what was that? Taka's gone! That's it's right! A Taka's <laughs> gone! It's like that Wheel of Fortune game we play where you're trying to solve the uh, puzzle and there's one letter missing and it's like, you have. 180 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm seeing now isn't what I saw before. Can you tell me what's different? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not in the doorway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got me. <laughs> well, what are you saying? Taka disappeared too? Stop, talking. Stop saying disappeared. <laughs> yeah. Boy, this is going to be the talk of the town. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't possibly begin to imagine. But if I could imagine. Anyway, our costume yeah. says that. <laughs> but if I could imagine, it would go exactly like this. <laughs> it gives a detailed yeah. account. Step one, the robot picked <laughs> up the body. In other words, <laughs> the only one who could have done this are Hiro and Kyoko, who are still miss- Damn it, my two favorites. Yeah, hold on a second, and two characters that you voice. 
I know. He's fucking- come on, man. <laughs> There's no guarantee that both murders were committed by the same person. Oh. Or mm. even that both people are dead. Like, I don't know. They, they, there's a lot up in the air about this one. Hmph. You seem very adamant about defending her. <laughs> Perhaps you are a simp. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Perhaps you simpin? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I just I just learned what that word means recently, and I want to use it in a sentence. I mean, they're dead, you know. Dead, gone forever. They're never coming back. Awful. This is all just too awful. Ina suddenly burst into tears. <laughs> <laughs> that is absurd. Uh, Bloop. Bleep. Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my God. I remember their name. You uh -oh. speak beautifully for a dead person. Yeah. Yasu. Oh. Bro. Holy crap. Wow. All right, in my mind, that makes it super definite that he is not the killer. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> the robot was like, when you die and you wake up, I'll kill your family if you don't say Yasuhiro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a twist. His eyes closed. And they never opened again. He must have been very sleepy. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all those potential justice hammers on the wall. <laughs> oh yeah, wow, you're right. Oh yeah, it was filled up last time. Yeah, and there's four missing. Well, oh. you fucking no. Look at you, Mr. Fucking Sleuth over there. That was originally just a dumb joke, but it's actually totally accurate. Yeah, seriously. There are many aspects to the incident this time. Too many, to be honest, considering that it may be good to look back on everything that's happened. Would you like my help? Yes. Okay, let's look back on things. It's more- Oh, man. This was a mistake. Hina and Sakura confirmed that the door was locked after we started looking for the missing bodies, and the door is designed so they can really be locked from inside. So in other words, when Hina checked it, someone had already gone in the repository and locked the door. When they were done, they unlocked it and left, which is why it's unlocked now. But Hina claims that there's no way someone could have beaten them to the repository. So that certain someone... Is nice. still in the room? Yeah. Kinda makes me wonder if Hifumi's really dead. Oh, wow. Maybe I should check somewhere else. There are some places I already know about. First the nurse's office where Hifumi was found, then the equipment's room where Taku was found. Yeah, maybe Hifumi maybe he, did it. Yeah, maybe he's the murderer. And he just gave himself a, a, a heckin' good bonk. Unless she's the killer, when it's her other personality. Oh, like and she doesn't to even know Toko it. Toko was the killer. Yeah. Oh and my she was god. just faking out her hatred of blood. Oh my god. Wow, wouldn't that be something? Oh my god. I'm just gonna say all the possibilities. Yeah. That way, when one of them turns out to be right, I'll look like a genius. <laughs> or it could be Byakuya. <laughs> And he yeah. has a body double, so... Exactly. Yeah. That reminds so when, when, when we do find out what happens, please everyone concentrate on the Dan called the right one instead of Dan called seven wrong ones. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this makes it clear, right? Not in the la this, least. This is a trap. What is? <laughs> it's a trap! Hmm. <laughs> Things grow ever more exciting. Um, what the fuck are you talking about? I've already repaid my debt. I don't know you any more explanation. What debt? What the fuck are you talking about? Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> you are not only the most obnoxious character because of your arrogance, you're also the most obnoxious because of your fucking cryptic nonsense. Some things made out of it looks like cardboard, plastic, and plaster? I mean, Jesus Christ. <laughs> like... <laughs> and a big note that says, I can't wait to kill Hifumi and Taka tonight. <laughs> This Robo Justice, and it's in Hero's room. Boy. This is this is like me when I try to kill people in Among Us. <laughs> yeah, remember when Jaden was like, "Okay, so what happened was I was watching the security cameras, and Roth started acting a little suspect, and then Dan killed Albert, <laughs> or something like that." <laughs> yeah, it was so funny. Yeah, yeah, because we just found we just snuck into Hero's room. 
which is kind of freaked up. And we, uh, we found boxes of blueprints for the costume that was kidnapping Hifumi. <laughs> so. Right. Did you just curse in the first minute, dude? Yeah, you can just put, <laughs> put, a, put an elephant over it. An elephant? Yeah, oh, this, like, the elephant like, sound. Or something, you know? Got it. Here, put this over um, it. Freaking... There you go. Great done. job. Really well done. F seamless. Yeah, so now Especially now since it's... we spent a minute talking about it afterwards. Well, now there's drama added to it, so that people can hear, they, they hear like this weird off-kilter freaking, and they're like, what the hell was that? And then like later, they'll be like, oh, that was the freaking. <laughs> <laughs> it all comes well full circle in the end. Robo okay. Justice? I mean- Wait a second. What? I have a question. Yeah. Robo Justice was the name that Hifumi gave to the robot. Yes. Not the robot- yeah. So why would why would Heroes Blueprints already have that name in there? Uh, yeah, well, I mean, he didn't say like I coined the name Robo Justice. He just was like it I was Robo. I thought he did. I thought he said I'm calling him Robo Justice. Oh, okay. Well, then, yeah, that seems pretty sus. Yeah. Oh, there's like nothing else in the room to select except for the boxes. All right, I'm out. Wait, maybe the bathroom door? Uh, no, that's it. That was it. Really? Well, it's gonna Are be like, sure? it's the bathroom door, dude! Like, this is what's gonna Why happen. Why don't you freaking click it? Alright. Well, it's not gonna be- it's not- Dan, I'm looking at a walkthrough, just trust me. <laughs> I'm just- I'm scared! No, I'm just scared! Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah. I feel better. Makoto, big news! Big news! Hifumi mm -hmm. and I are getting married! What's wrong? <laughs> Yoko, and... I mean... <laughs> Phew, man, I have had the worst day! <laughs> have you, hero? Yeah. Hero? I guess I'll talk to Hero. <laughs> hero looks ridiculous. <laughs> Not to mention, you totally can't bend at the waist. Seems like a pretty obvious oversight. Why That's my... gonna be important. Yeah. Why is my hair blue? I don't understand why my hair is blue now. That's not <laughs> Makoto, do you have a second? Yeah, I've got nothing else going on. <laughs> don't no. peel away just yet. Do you think my head sort of looks like an upside down purple butt? <laughs> yes, I think that every time. Does the time. part in my hair look like butt cheeks? <laughs> it totally does. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to help me with the investigation. You just see a little poopy like come out like. All right, Aaron, please. <laughs> <laughs> you remember the wristwatch Taco always wore on his left hand? No. <laughs> Are you so oblivious to the people around you? Do you dislike other people that much? Do you not take careful notations and catalog what watch every person you know is wearing at all times? Oh, yeah, I do. Sorry, I was mistaken. No, that's not it. Anyway, do you say you had a watch? Take a look. It's broken. <laughs> His watch is ended now. <laughs> <laughs> you can oh, see <laughs> there was a third murder. <laughs> what if it wasn't just a scrap of paper when he was holding it? What if it was something more important? What if he was reaching down Hifumi's pants to get the goods? <laughs> and how would something important like that become a mere scrap of paper? That's what you need to answer. I mean, I'd answer it, but I don't feel like it. What the fuck are you talking about? Hey. That's such and a while weird we're way it, to word it. I should tell you one other thing. The two victims this time definitely had their e-handbooks on them. So the handbooks have nothing to do with how the murders were carried out. Okay, thanks for that. Not that there was any reason to think they were connected to the killings in the first place. What the fuck is wrong with you? Do you, do you just like talk to walls your whole life? Yeah, her, 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 um, her ability to interact with other human beings is somewhat lacking. Yes. So you're saying I don't have to think about the handbooks this time, right? right? If you didn't have to think about them at all, I wouldn't have gone out of my way to mention it. Hmm. Perhaps there is a method to her madness. Jesus Christ. Just say- words have purpose and meaning. Just say words that mean things. If it does turn out to be Hufumi, I'm going to say this one was a lot easier than the last one. The last one had me way more confused. Yeah, well, I'm- But I'm, it might not be Hufumi. I'm like absolutely sure that you're right. You think so? Yeah, I, I would bet money on it. It does- it does tick all the boxes. Do you want to bet money on it? No, I don't, Aaron. God damn it. You never want to bet. What is wrong with you? I don't know. It's almost like you have a mature sense of your finances. It's almost as if I'm not dumb enough to 
throw money away <laughs> for no reason. It's not for no reason, it's for the opportunity to make more money. <laughs> Oh, wow. Isn't Spoken it, like a guy that does not have a problem. Hey, isn't investing in money just a form of gambling? Or investing in companies? No. Yeah, it is. <laughs> they could fail or whatever. Sure they could. You don't know. You're, you're right, Aaron. You're so right. It's just like educated gambling. What the fuck does that have to do with anything we're talking about right now? Uh, I'm just saying, like, everything's a gamble. Maybe we could put 20 bucks down on whether it's not even we did it. <laughs> Maybe we could put 20 bucks on whether it's not a gamble, did you say? <laughs> no, whether Hifumi did it or not. Well, oh, okay. Would you push the button, please? Sorry. This trial has been brought to you by Butterfinger. Mm-mm-mm, <laughs> <laughs> never lay a finger on my Butterfinger. <laughs> and, so the, and so the curtain opened once again. A deadly judgment. A deadly deception. A deadly betrayal. A deadly riddle. A deadly defense. A deadly faith. Deadly class trial, a deadly fart, a deadly smell. Do you want to save the data? <laughs> yeah. A deadly save! Hero was the suspicious individual in the suit, but he's not the culprit. So what you're saying is... That's right. That he is the culprit, the culprit but he's not the suit the of the robot in the justice that didn't <laughs> have the suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> That makes perfect exactly. sense. Exactly. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! You had it wrong. Holy crap, man! You are cool. Oh, hang in there. Lies will get you nowhere. You're doing well. Away with you. Okay, Jesus Christ. Yes, dude, great job. This should prove it. Ah, my <laughs> argument. <laughs> <laughs> I've been shot with logic! Oh, there you Boom, go. there it is. Oh, fuck off! Yeah. You couldn't bend over in it. How do you. How do you well done. That? Aaron? I'm here. You're absolutely okay, right. <laughs> sorry. Push a dolly without a handle if you stoop down low. But if you were when you get low, get low. Do you think you could actually get into a position like that? Who do you think you are, Shorty? Yeah. What do you mean, what do you mean? You were the- the one that wore the costume and figured out it couldn't bend over. What seems impossible to put the suit on or take it off without help? Then, That's true. You really can't take it off by yourself? No. Hero wasn't just making it up? <laughs> I wasn't just making it up! Ah! <laughs> it just like, strangles her. <laughs> oh, oh no! <laughs> of course I wasn't making it up! Instead of seizing on one viewpoint, the truth is uncovered by analyzing things from every angle. Oh, right. thank you for describing what problem solving is, Perhaps. Kyoko. It's not condescending at all. <laughs> Let's take another look back at what happened. I suppose we could start with this morning. Four of us gathered this morning. in the dining hall. Makoto, Hina, <laughs> oh What's this morning? <laughs> Are we fucking doing the whole series of events yeah. again? Yeah, yeah. It's my only complaint about this game. Mm -hmm. I love this game. I love everything about it except for this. Yeah. Uh, yeah, what? What was that? This kid from downstairs. Hifumi's in the nurse. Good man. We are actually flashbacking to a previous flashback. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yeah, just chase the subjects. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> we found Hifumi dead, yep. I remember. Uh-huh. And then we found Taka Please, dead. Just make this part optional. <laughs> <laughs> just say, would you like to review the case again? Oh man, this can't be happening. Oh, wait, who is it? And then we went back to the thing. We found out Hifumi was gone. We went up, and Taga was gone, and then we still went down. Hifumi was gone, and then we took the elevator here. And then you asked, "Do you need to remember all this?" And then you started telling us. You you began with. <laughs> yes. God, yes. It happened already. I don't need to fucking see this. Stole the numbering. I've stalled the numbering, and now I will fire it back at you. <laughs> what order? Boom. Do you really? No, stop. Break. Everybody if you were fun. given four hammers, labeled There's one, no two, three, and four, would you think I have to hit people <laughs> with the hammers in the order that they are laid out here? Yeah. What the f- I mean, that's the dumbest logic. Yeah. Right. If anything, 
that's just another way the killer tried to disguise their actions. So you're saying the culprit wanted us to think the hammers were used in order... Yes, in super genius. <laughs> Wait, hold on a second. <laughs> Let's see the proof. You mean to tell me four comes after three? What do you mean, let's see the proof? Why are you asking <laughs> for proof on something that I'm asserting and yet assuming that this other thing is true when it also doesn't have proof? Bro, you think I haven't survived a hangman's gambit once or twice <laughs> in my life? I'm like the, the hangman's gambit m mamba jamba. You don't get a day past 25 unless you've survived at least one hangman's game. <laughs> it's almost 10 o'clock, you know that. Bedtime for all the little boys and girls! <laughs> I'll be dead soon. <laughs> yeah. Super Saiyan Taka was right. Then he must have been attacked around 6 this morning. And that would be his official time of death. But if that's true, then he was killed well before he flew me. I know. That's what we're trying to prove, Sakura. God, does anybody <laughs> listen? <laughs> Solid alibis for when we heard Hifumi scream. Since all of us were there together, clearly none of us could have killed him. Okay. He does not stop there. Okay. It was also the moment. <laughs> it's just one guy like standing there, <laughs> slack jawed, listening to him. Okay. Okay, uh -huh. cool. Dope. <laughs> Uh-huh. His body apparently disappeared in the one minute her and Hina took their eyes off of it. But to carry that much weight from the So I just change his voice halfway through the game and just But to carry that much weight? <laughs> There's no way! It'd be impossible! He's totally fat! <laughs> like like it just dawns on Hero what they're trying to say. <laughs> it's like, oh my god, Hero, Jesus. <laughs> what? If the dead body were to move itself. Oh shit. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah. Dan, you, uh -huh. fucking, you fucking called it, dude. You called it like Wow, I'm I'm very proud of myself. Yeah. Is it possible? Sure it is. He was alive. <laughs> 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 yes, it is really possible. For fuck's sake, you guys, do I really have to shoot <laughs> truth bullets at this one? <laughs> <laughs> Playing it cool, hero. Good to see. It didn't seem weird at the time, but it contradicts what Monokuma just told us, doesn't it? Yeah, but Ifumi was still alive when that one went off. Exactly. If we were actually rediscovering both bodies, the announcement shouldn't have played. Hmm. In reality, when the two dead bodies were rediscovered, one of them was actually being oh crap for the first time. So, when we found Hifumi the first time in the nurse's office... Oh, but he was dead the second time? But he woke up and talked to... what's-her-face? Meaning, he wasn't actually found dead until we came upon him in the repository. Oh, so Hifumi's not the murderer. He's what? just dead. But he became to life again! When Hina cried on him. That's when they rediscovered him. Come on, don't fucking do this. Like, it was airtight, and now it's not. I found the item he used to wipe them clean in the nurse's office trash can. No oh, shit! Oh, what, what was the thing that cleaned his glasses? It was the hammer! <laughs> if Hifumi was still alive at that point, the disappearance of Taka's body is easily explained. It should be perfectly obvious who must have moved Taka's corpse. Um, it was Hifumi. <laughs> it was Sakura. It was Sakura! She's like, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> the single biggest fact pointing to his involvement has yet to be revealed. You know what I'm talking about, right? We'll talk about it next time on Don Gone Run Pot. Oh, man. Oh, God. It's so... Uh. Oh, no. I was just making a joke. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, these episodes go so fast, dude. Yeah. I didn't say next time on Game Bros. I see. It was like a, okay. There was just something about her wording that was very like. There's one yeah, other cliffhanger. thing, and then like you know, it fades to black, and then the ass cream mm. is what you need, you know. <laughs> this one's a little different. In my note, it said Monokuma can't find out, so don't tell anyone else for now. Let's meet in the rec room at 1 a.m. See. Then this note isn't the same one Hero got. <gasps> it's not the same. 
Yeah, you li <laughs> You just said it's different. <laughs> different means not the same. <laughs> What? When we found him in the repository? Yeah, he was dead, but that's why the announcement played. But if <laughs> Some someone killed him in between those moments. But he came back to life. No, no, that was before. What? No. It was when they were both in the same room. He they they found them and then Hina came in and was like, "No, he found me." And then he was like, "I'm genuinely confused." Right? Like that's why I'm confused. Yeah, yeah. According to the Monokuma file, the way Taka and Hifumi were killed was almost the same, with them having similar fractures and all. Mm -hmm. But Justice Hammer three and four were still laying around in the nurse's office and equipment room, right? Mm -hmm. So if Hifumi was killed, oh, he was killed by one of the the hammers, and then it was cleaned. Mmm, yes. Robert would have had to grab one of the hammers, kill Afumi, then put the hammer back where they found it. But wouldn't that be seriously risky for him? Good work, hero. <laughs> yeah, that's like the smartest thing he's ever said. There, there it is. Fuck! God damn my fucking aim! Oh, what the wow. hell, dude? <laughs> Brutal. Just <laughs> Give me a goddamn break. Am I ever gonna cleanly do any one of these? I'd also like to point out that the repository has all kinds of hammers. Big ones, small ones. Some as big as your head. Fuck! <laughs> good good job, Aaron. <laughs> Shut up! Great work. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't be able to do it either! Ah! Fuck! Okay, it's the other way around. Alright, switch it around. They're not working together. One person murdered someone, and another person murdered someone. Give me the god fucking god! You, you, you have to shoot away the purple thing and... Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think you have to. I think you can absorb really? it with the purple thing, yeah. Oh, okay. See? There you, you go, do. great. Yeah, you oh. showed me, Aaron. <laughs> So stupid, Dan! <laughs> you don't know anything about how Danganronpa's specific shit works. That'll teach you to help. <laughs> hey everybody, welcome back to Game Grumps. People oh. murdered, everyone's dead. Yes, people have been murdered, and we've been having fun. And that's what's important. Yeah, I mean, it was just a bit that I was like, uh, uh, like I'm... That's just a bit. Just everyone, so everyone knows that. <laughs> <laughs> cool. So we're here, uh, we are at the end of Trial 3. Well, see, the reason um, that I, I ex expounded on that it was a bit, it was because I started out the episode with it as a bit, and then I realized that starting an episode with, like, Hey guys, makes it sound like I don't want to do the episode. So then I- Oh. But so then I was like, oh, I probably shouldn't have started with that bit then. So I just felt like I should elaborate on the bit, so that people knew that I wasn't- That I wasn't like, oh, here we go, here's another one, but it was just a bit instead. Do you want to- do you want to explode onto the scene? Try oh, again? oh, you mean like- like redo it? Yeah. Alright, yeah. <clears throat> okay, here we go. What's up everybody? Aaron H here with my boy Danny D! I'm- I'm- I'm kind of lost now. I don't know who this is, cuz yeah. I thought Hifumi was just the murderer. Yeah, that was clean, and it was like interesting, and was like a fun twist. I mean, we figured it but out. There's a double twist. Yeah. There's multiple twists. It's it's like a crazy straw. Yeah. You remember? Do you remember when I was talking about every when that when all that shit was happening, you know? And there was all the flashbacks and stuff. Celeste was always like conveniently like, "I'm here. Here I am. Whoa, what's going right. on here?" Well, she's also the only person who was also involved in a hammering, should they say? That's and true. And she took the picture and, uh, man. Yeah. Yeah, I would- I, I would guess Celeste. Oh yeah, cause like, Hifumi probably posed for the picture with like, the costume. Right. Or whatever. Yeah, I don't- oh yeah. Here's Let's try it. Answer. Oh, that's- that's <laughs> right, I guess. Pray to God it's right! <laughs> the only ones who ever actually saw Robo-Justice firsthand were Celeste and Hifumi. Shush, the adults are talking now.
Oh, right. Bjorka. As he said, only Don't let him push you around like that, Makoto. <laughs> what are you- Then why are you being a dick about it? I literally yeah. just said something that nobody has said yet. We headed to the second floor specifically because of what she claimed to have seen. Next, to draw <laughs> She's like, to oh shit, he's tearing me apart oh, next to me. Oh shit, I'm gonna get a thousand baseballs <laughs> shot at me. <laughs> Aaron, you're goth queen. She's a schemer. That's fine. It's just... It's fine. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, sure. Very well, then Makoto and- uh, Very well, then Makoto and Hina, you come with me to the nervous office. I will leave the capture of the suspicious individual to Toko, Pyaku, and Sakura. Dan, look, she did what had to be done. Well, uh, <laughs> she did what had to be done? Yes. <laughs> that was a uh, Freudian slip there. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what did I do? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, shit. <laughs> Looking back, I can say that that one little slip up was your undoing. All right, fucking say it, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, jeez. Don't leave me in suspense. We're all going to die here. We're all going to die, just like those guys did. I remember her saying that too. But... Oh, Whoa. she didn't know that there had been multiple deaths at this point. She didn't. I, maybe not. Maybe that's what they're alluding to. Push the button. Yaki you said the Celeste comment doesn't make sense, but what is he alluding to? Do I really- do we really have to do this? Is that really you what we're doing right it. now? You better believe it. Shoot that shit. It's not a picture of the suspect dragging Hifumi away. I would say it's a picture of Hifumi dragging the suspect away. <laughs> Good. Good. Um, no it's not! Shut up! <laughs> I bet it said- Oh, well, I think she's innocent. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Don't make me laugh, you idiot. What do you mean, checkmate? Ah, uh, that's always the uh, sure sign of innocence. Yeah. The blind, wide-eyed rage. <laughs> Think back to how Hifumi used to talk to us. How did he refer to each of us? Um... I guess he said people's last names. Uh, yeah, I suppose so. Yeah, he says, he says, Naegi! Naegi, yeah. Exactly. I know I heard him say Mr. Naegi more than once, for example. So if Hifumi did mean to say Hiro's name, he would have said his last name, Hagakure. I'm sure it was just incidental. By chance, he just, his first name. That's a, that's a huge coincidence there. Yeah. That they framed Hiro for the crime, and then he... Said hero's name. Wait, is Celeste's last name Yasuhiro? Yasu I, I, I guess. It's never. They've never said her last name. I don't think. No, 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 no. It, it's um. It's, it's like, a European sounding. It's like name. Bumblestein or whatever. Yeah, something Berg. Ludenberg. That's it. Celeste won't give up. So then, I have to do something to make her accept it. Your last name is Yasuhiro, because we want it to be! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't know, I don't understand. That's an invasion of privacy. Oh, is it? I guess we all care about that now in the murder school. <laughs> can you please just tell us what really happened? Please, just tell us. Come on, please. Please. Yeah, please. <laughs> You're breaking my heart. <laughs> Super please. I'm put in check, it's just my nature not to give up. Because, 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 until the game's over. Because of the wonderful things he does. <laughs> la 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 la. <laughs> oh my God! Are you fucking kidding me, <laughs> dude? Was there any doubt? Oh no. Act two. Uh, so I guess the note would have brought uh, hero in. Listen. I think it's the clock for no specific reason. Okay. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> All right, cool with me. <laughs> I mean, why this didn't music they? Is cool. Why didn't they just pin it on Hero? Like, why would they have to make a suit for him? They could have easily like taken a picture that made it look like he was attacking them, even if he was passed out. Yeah, I don't know. I guess because then we wouldn't have a video game on our hands. <laughs> 
and get rid of the one person who could betray them. And they did it using an ordinary, everyday hammer from the repository. Mm -hmm. So evil. Everything that happened in this case. And the villain behind it all is... Celeste! Bam, baby. Mwah. I love you. I love you. I love you. Wow, that's a cool effect. Hell yeah. Sorry, you lose. Do you think the whole point of this game is so so Kyoko is the mole, but she's not like a bad mole. She's like used. Yeah, I w I had that thought too. Like she's she's like a double agent. Yeah, and who's she supposed to be working. For Monokuma, but she's actually helping the heroes. Yeah, and she's like training Naegi to be the ultimate oh. investigator. <laughs> That'd be cool. <laughs> I would love that. And it only took eight murdered teenagers to do it. <laughs> I, Celestia Ludenberg. Actually, no. Bust out that e-handbook. Yes, a hero is fine. Oh. Oh shit! She just straight up admitted it. So. Finally accepted it. I'm the kind of person. Once I've lost, I don't like things to drag on. Interesting. Oh, she's doing an accent the whole time. Yeah. Goodness gracious. Damn, dude. A, a lot of C's. A, I saw a, some C's a, at the beginning. Oh, really? There. Yeah. Well, you know what? But, oh, hey, you averaged it out. Nicely Hold done. Out. Who will become the blackened? You make the right choice? It'll be like in Among Us where everyone votes for Celeste and there's one vote for like Kyoko. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like, why did you vote for what the fuck? <laughs> like for the rest of the game. Dude, what what I don't know, I just felt like it. Ding dong, guilty. Yeah. But how did you get him to agree? I can't Im imagine he would have happily agreed to commit murder. I'm sure she relied on her speciality. Lying. <laughs> My specialty! Don't make me laugh! I didn't have to lie to get him to agree. Then did you use... You know... I knew you'd figure it out, Kyoko. Chicken wings? <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to say something I've never said before in my life. You're a fucking liar! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill him. I'm going to f f f f fucking kill him. Wait, please. No, don't. Don't. Please don't kill him. Well, that would be terrible. I'm going to say something I've never said before in my life. <laughs> no more pizza, please. <laughs> All I asked him to do was make something to hide the face and general body size. I had no idea he'd make something like that, but it's my fault for picking him in the first place. So why'd you decide to make me the suspect? Because you're dumb. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there you go. That's it? I'm this. stupid? <laughs> Wait a second. You mean to tell me I'm stupid? That's... that's you. Oh, sorry. I, I, I had a panic attack. I thought my uh, audio hadn't been working for the last two and a half hours. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay. That's why I was like, oh, oh no. <laughs> As I explained to Hifumi, the plan was, well, you were all questioning about what... It happened to him, I was going to murder someone else. At that point, Hifumi would have an alibi, so nobody could doubt him. I told him that, and he believed it because he didn't know what an alibi was. It all seems very straightforward, stereotypical. I can't wait till he's dead. Yeah, I really look forward to him dying. <laughs> they they kind of set it up that way. Yeah. You, you really want him and Genocide Jill to, to eat it. Yeah. I wanted to get out! Every day it's for torture! And you do, guys are assholes! <laughs> and do you want to know why? Huh? You want to know why? Because I had a dream. And accepting a life here would have meant nothing less than giving up on my dream forever. Honestly. And there was no way that I could ever do that. In the underground world of gambling, I risked my life to make a metaphorical killing. As for me, and it was fall for that dream. And what was this dream of yours? To live in a European castle. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Oh, sick. Ah, she wanted to be a Ludenberg. Yeah. And to gather handsome men from all over the world to serve as my butler slash bodyguards. I was going to make them dress up like vampires and satisfy them, find my every need. Damn. All right, all right, I can get behind that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <Once I'm, laughs> this is understandable. It's not just other people. I can even fool my own emotions. The conscious deceives the unconscious. And that's why you're not scared? Yes. That's right. I don't feel death. Kill me however you like. 
I'm sure in the cutscene though, my eyes will widen and I'll be like, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> but you know, if I could be reincarnated, if I had a choice, then I think I would like to come back as Marie Antoinette. You know, she also got executed. Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> you just get executed again. It's punishment time! Yeah! I guess I like right, Kyoko right. hold on to this. What? Your room key! <laughs> Will it really give you the hope you're oh. looking for? I can't say I ever saw it that way. Which is why, actually, it's not important. Oh, okay. Well, I don't understand. Yeah, that was all very mysterious. We'll meet again. Mm. In another life. Yeah, I'll be reincarnated as Mary Antoinette's friend, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. We'll be reincarnated as someone who died 200 years ago. <laughs> time for the po well, time is a is a is a construct. Wow, Aaron, thanks. <laughs> it was very eye-opening. She seems pretty thrilled. Oh, is she gonna be burned at whoa, the stake whoa. like a witch? I don't know. It looks like it. So many cute animals, though. Yeah. Yep. The burning of the Versailles witch, damn. Alright. Cool. Well, see you later. You saw the Silent Hill movie, right? Yeah, it's pretty gruesome. Fushy, fushy! <laughs> Ooh, so stylized. Burn, burn, burn. Yeah, this is like an indie game. Like, <laughs> yeah. Burn. If I ever burn to death, I hope it's by stylized fire. Yeah, that would be fun. Burn, baby, burn. Holy Disco crap! Burn, no, burn. This is very baby, gothic. Burn. burn the mother down. Oh yeah, she's totally accepting it. Yeah. She's shredding a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, the firefighter oh, wow. comes. What the fuck? <laughs> She's gonna smash this into is, her? That's- yeah, that's not gonna help. That's not gonna help things at all. I feel like that's like a mercy, almost, that they did that. <laughs> yeah. Well, alright. Sizzle, sizzle! I did it. I put the is that all? Is that all that's left of her? Is that what that's supposed to signify? I... I don't know. They really did hang on that screen for a while, though. Mm -hmm. you take it in. It's well over! Well then! <laughs> yep. I guess we'll see everyone's reaction next time on Game Grabs, right? Well... Sure, if you like. I like getting to the end of the chapter. They, they always say, like, two minutes of things. Oh, okay. Right, let's do it then. Yeah, yeah. Kyoko, did I say you get some kind of key type object from Celeste? So, uh, what's the deal with that? I'm not telling. Yeah. Yeah, well, yeah I'll never tell. What's the matter? So I'll ask you a question if you answer mine. What did you do? What did you do to me? What? What? Hey. Answer me. What did you do to my body? Oh, shit. Uh, oh man, oh jeez, oh man, oh jeez, what uh, what do you mean, what did I do? I have did no idea. Did you make her a robot? I don't know anything about it. Is she a cyborg? As we approached the dressing room, Kyoko looked back at us and said, Beep boop. <laughs> Beep boop boop. <apples. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go to the dining hall, okay? <laughs> Soup's hungry. Huh, so Makoto and Kyoko are gonna go together? Uh, does that mean what I think it means? Good luck, Makoto. Girls like her are total pushovers when you show that back then. Whoa, what? <laughs> what I heard from Kyoko then was... Oh, um... This is such a perfect cliffhanger moment, come on. <laughs> uh... <laughs> what, me? <laughs> yeah, to stop the episode on. Oh, I think it- I think if you hit A, it'll just say end of chapter three. Oh, really? I, that's what that would be my guess. Well, frankly, it kind of blew my mind. Right after I told Kyoko I believe in her, she told me a story that was, well, almost unbelievable. I mean. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, we'll end the episode. I didn't believe that. I decided I had to confirm what she told me with my own two eyes. Two eyes. My tune eyes. Wow. <laughs> you and the word I. It's just. <laughs> <laughs> something really, there's some blockage there. When I think of tune eyes, I think of like the Hanna-Barbera sound effects. It's like <laughs> <laughs> The boy's bathroom on the second floor doesn't have a surveillance camera or monitor in it. 
That's a shame because I really wanted to look at some wiener <laughs> and in the storage closet there. The secret Kyoko told me about could it really be hidden here? She's just been taking massive dumps into this bucket. <laughs> I can't take poopies in here. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> she said it was. She said it was in the back. It was way in the back of the storage closet. You know, like way in the back of this <laughs> three by three storage closet. Yeah, I was gonna say. Turned out. The back wall was like a revolving door, and I'd made my way to the other side. Just like Kyoko had said. Correct. Remember when she just said it? <laughs> In the boys' bathroom on the second floor, there's a storage closet. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. I can't quite remember. What do I know? What don't I know? I... I... Uh, <laughs> oh. Holy uh -oh. crap, what? Uh -oh. Oh damn! Oh shit! Did we just us. die? Oh. <laughs> Through the rest of the game, you play as a ghost. Oh, just like phasmophobia. Yeah, I have to walk around the gym, and <laughs> you guys are like, "I wonder if Dan was watching over us, helping us," and I'm like somewhere else, like trying to figure out, like, "Oh, can I pick up this basketball?" <laughs> oh no! The books are gone. An empty bookshelf. <laughs> oh, empty. Gone. <laughs> it's all gone. The yearbooks, the student registry, and even the note that had fallen on the floor. It's all gone? Remember what Kyoko told me? <laughs> <laughs> Things are getting blurry. Can't see Mom's in front of me. Mom's <laughs> 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 Mom's brown Mom's brown curry. <laughs> As I desperately hauled my shaky frame toward the gym. The sound got stronger and stronger. Mom's badonger. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm done. No more of that joke. <laughs> Kacha! Bakyu! Hagagya! Haya! Paching! Bakya! Dadadan! Sha 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 sha! <laughs> what are we summoning something? Whoa! 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 What the f. What in the world? This wasn't part of the deal! The deal? The deal? What? The deal? Made a decision. Whoa. I will no longer retreat. No longer compromise. No longer regret. Hell yeah, dude. I've made my decision. <gasps> I'm going to resist you. Hell yeah! Oh shit! Hmm. Okay. But now she's gonna die. You do realize what will happen if you go through with this, right? You haven't forgotten, have you? Oh. Um, yeah, actually, uh, I think I might have. <laughs> it's okay, I watch 90 Day Fiance, I watch people make mistakes all the time. <laughs> what am I looking at? What am I hearing? A hostage? Then could it be? The mastermind spy is... No, my favorite! Wow, really? S Sakura? Yeah, but she, like, is rebelling, so that's cool. She's the last person I would have suspected. Yeah. I guess that's why it was effective. Wow. Really dropping like flies now, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> to be All continued. All right, there was the end. Yeah, there was the end of part three. Well, we're not done. <gasps> no. S Super Robo Justice. Oh, hooray. I'm gonna put it on my shelf. Yeah. It can remind me of the three friends that died yesterday. Leon killed Sayaka. Just in case you missed this. Yeah. Monokuma killed Junko. God, this is like the Gashly Crumb Tinies. Then Leon got- What? What did I see yesterday? It's not like I have one of the people I saw yesterday right in front of me and could ask. I don't yeah. understand. And why did I see it at a Dutch angle? <laughs> yeah. And why is the screen all warbly? Sakura <laughs> is the mastermind spy? Can and why that... is there that one Tetris piece missing from the wall? <laughs> I just want to complete it! Maybe then the wall will disappear and we can get out of here! <laughs> if you fill your belly, I'm sure you'll all cheer up, so let's eat! You're just hungry, that's all! You're just hungry! <laughs> it's just like beating her head on the wall like, ah, you're just hungry! It's like, oh my god! <laughs> I'm totally okay. I'm not gonna die. Why? Because there aren't gonna be any more murders. Oh, okay. I misunderstood <laughs> how, how he said that. Why? Cause there aren't gonna be any more murders. I'm not gonna die. Why? Cause there aren't gonna be any more murders. <laughs> <laughs> um... Sorry, I, 
I like to answer my own rhetorical questions. <laughs> Can I just say, as an aside, um, I'm not really a college football fan, but the quarterback for uh, the Indiana Hoosiers, his last name is Penix. P E N I X. <laughs> and I'm like, dude, I would buy that jersey in a fucking heartbeat. <laughs> He's referring to the urban legend where aliens abduct cows and dissect them as part of their research. Actually... No! You're calling <laughs> it an urban legend? As a matter of fact, it's true. As a matter of fact, it's happened to me. <laughs> I was a cow! It all happened one day where I went to go get a hamburger. It was a place I'd never been before. They claimed their patties were 100% all beef. Damn. Now this is- now this is where the game gets deep. Yeah. So I got a burger to go and headed home. I have a strong feeling this story is not gonna go anywhere. And before long, the sky was filled with a mysterious blinding light. <laughs> I'm so sad that Hero is probably gonna die because he's one of my favorite characters in any game. That goes for me too, of course. I would never kill any of my friends. Not a one you of you! <laughs> Kyoko, you guys, can on the you other come hand, over here for a second. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Vitamins, minerals, amino acids, creatine, and what? They even have protein zyme X, <laughs> which is definitely real. Mm -hmm. What? What's that? It's made of unobtainium. <laughs> a high-quality protein drink. It's nothing like that cheap swill in the warehouse. It's kind of sewer level. Oh yeah. This is amazing. It's a gold mine. Ah, oh, my prayers have finally been answered! Time to load up some more prayers then! I hope I yeah. don't die! <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, start with that one. That's a great prayer. Oh, there's a picture on the floor. This picture... Oh, weird. Was that Sayaka? Yeah, that's Sayaka, Celeste, and Hifumi. Oh. It's just like that picture I saw before! It's so weird. Why does everyone know each other and they're not saying anything? Yeah. No one mentioned anything like that. I- I still posit that this entire thing is, a uh, is a ploy to, like, train me. And I think everyone's in on it. Um, and I'm supposed to be the ultimate detective or some shit. Oh man, I don't that's, know. There's so many ways you could go with this. That's my theory. So does that mean this picture was taken before they ever came to Hope's Peak? Which would mean everyone in the picture knew each other before they got here? Including Sayaka! International pop star? <laughs> Every time he says Sayaka, he starts like crying. He's like, Even Sayaka! <laughs> no, there's no way. I see way. her everywhere. There, there's six pictures of Sayaka up on the wall dressed as old Japanese men. <laughs> oh, Sayaka, I miss you. So I miss you. <laughs> you think the moon landing was fake too? Come on! Well, then. actually, the Van Allen radiation belts, there's no way that they could have gotten through that and survived to get to the moon. <laughs> and yeah, then, haven't you seen this, you, uh, the big C on a rock? <laughs> yeah, unless you read a science article, in which case you find out that that's total horseshit and <laughs> it's no problem to pass through that. So Man. the picture is real? Yeah. It's really real? <laughs> Great job. If that's Let's true. He's- he's a detective, if ever there was one. <laughs> if that's the case... Uh... <laughs> if that's the case, what? Yeah. Is it real or is it fake? It's real. So you're saying it's real? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me flash back to two seconds ago when you said it was real. <laughs> What's up everybody, it's your boy Aaron from Game Grumps, and also we've got with us... It me. Is this a grand piano like the one Sayaka used to pick us up? <laughs> it seems really old. I bet it's worth a lot of money. Of course, without someone around who could play it like Sayaka, it's totally useless. No, is, is this a grand piano? No, stupid. It's one piano, not a thousand. <laughs> <laughs> How would we even fit a thousand pianos in here? <laughs> Well, um, I did find the secret room, but as soon as I started looking around, I was attacked. What? Attacked? By who? Certainly it wasn't me, the only other yeah. person who knows about the room. <laughs> <laughs> well, they came from behind and I didn't have any time to react, so I didn't see who it was. 
but it smelled a lot like Kyoko. Wait a second. Yeah, yeah. They yelled, it's me, Kyoko, and then everything <laughs> went black. That's all I know for now. <laughs> and when I came to, the mountains of files and documents were all gone. Like the mountains of documents and files that are in your hands right now, <laughs> Kyoko. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know how important those were. It was my Don't fault worry. that you stole them. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get to the bottom of this soon. <laughs> it's okay. I already saw what I needed to in there. The back of your head as I walloped it. <laughs> then let me ask you something else. How much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? And also, You've do you given know... me a lot to think about. <laughs> <laughs> then she fades away. Do you know about the note that was left in there? The note that said, you must not leave. Just a second. We shouldn't talk about that. Because that's the note I gave to you. I wrote to you to make sure you'd stand in one spot. As I wound up and brought the hammer down. Not here. So now it's your turn. Let's hear your secret. Huh? I peed the bed until I was in fifth grade. No, not that secret. <laughs> Ultimate bedwetter, like, appears on the screen. <laughs> wow, tell her or don't tell her? I mean... I I'm... really like her. I, I say tell her. Yeah? I mean, um, I could be totally wrong. You're 100% wrong. I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, okay. I don't know, I just want the game to move. Right. I haven't found any conclusive evidence yet. But remember what you said the other day about the secret room? <laughs> Flashback. If I talk about it now, it could just make things that much worse. Friends shouldn't keep secrets, but there's nothing worse than expressing doubt about your friend when you don't have evidence. Oh, so I don't tell her. I tried to tell her and then it didn't work. And it, yeah, it didn't happen? Well, she... <laughs> Alright. That's so stupid. Yeah. There was a big shelf in the chem lab on the fourth floor and it had all kinds of chemicals and stuff. Okay. And there was an all-star cast of nutrient additives and supplements. You should we did a lot of huffing. <laughs> yeah. I'm like really high right now. I haven't been this, de this depressed since my house burned to the ground. Someone do something to cheer me up. Uh, can I say something? It's cause my dad was smoking in bed. <laughs> That's- no, I have something I'd like to report. <laughs> Get out of the way, we have to talk to Alter Ego. I'll Get out of here! I'll say it loud enough for every camera in this place to pick it up. <laughs> That's what Master wants, I'll do anything he asks. He even didn't put me in a TikTok video where I'm on a leash in a McDonald's and he's feeding me Big Mac. Is, oh, what, yeah. is that a thing? <laughs> That's absolutely a Jeez. thing. Man, I don't- I don't watch I don't TikTok. want the internet anymore. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh. Ah, shit. You just love being- okay. Uh, oh, well, fine. <laughs> Insulted? If you really want me to go, by all means- Ah, shit, it's on auto! Fuck! Okay, there we go. Oh, God. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> hey, guys! What's going on? Sure, I analyzed the files and extracted all the useful information I could find. There was, like, a lot of porn on here. Like, a lot. <laughs> <laughs> With that face. That's awesome. <laughs> It seems that the reason they devised this plan was because of what happened one year ago. This is how they described that event. They said it was the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in history. It was the, it was the hurtest, most dumbest, most stupid, heckest event in history. Then is this really the end? Is there no more information on that computer? <laughs> Is it possible to look up a reverse gangbang? <laughs> we'll get halfway through the answer and that's it? <laughs> it would appear so disappointing. Oh, wait. Sorry, I just waded through some of the other porn. There's one other thing I forgot to mention. I think it might be important and... Ah, okay, I believe it has to do with the mastermind. The mastermind! Kyogo's fingers moved even faster than they had so far. They flew off! Mastermind. <laughs> Did you figure out the Mastermind's identity? No, that I still don't know. But I did find a clue, I think. The one leading the Hope's Peak staff, the one who finalized the plan to isolate you, is here in this video getting DP'd. <laughs> <laughs> no matter what it takes, I will find the Headmaster. No matter the cost. Yoko, what's no going on? No matter how many on? dicks he has to take. <laughs> 
kind of tired. Goodbye, everyone. See you later. With that, mm. the laptop entered sleep mode. <laughs> Get it? Because she's tired. We set up her 56k modem. <laughs> hey, come on, it's just a program. You can tell the difference between a program and a friend, right? But you know, what's the difference between us and that program, really? When you think about it, it really makes you think, doesn't it? Is everyone high <laughs> in this room right now? Alter Ego said that what happened one year ago is what started everything. Yeah, he said it was the biggest, most awfulest, most hopelessest event in human history, right? It must have been a huge incident, whatever it was. Flashback, somebody like drops their ice cream. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> Someone will pay. <laughs> we have to find the headmaster of Hope's Peak Academy. We have to find him and make him tell us everything. And then we'll drink their liberal tears. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait, hold on, I wasn't- Thought <laughs> <laughs> oh, you are gonna barrel into her. <laughs> Did you just shut up already, Hina? You've been running your filthy mouth like that all the morning. Filthy? Me? Don't make me repeat my m m myself I'm not filthy. No use tonight and we can also see how disgusting you are. How can I be filthy when my conscience is so clean? <laughs> <laughs> she shut up, you don't even know what you're talking about. You and that lust your body of yours. Night after night you go out for your illicit club meeting. Hey, knock it off! I can't deal with dirty stuff like that! Your midnight sex curricular activity. Oh my god. Only put us in even more danger. It's the name of the next Ninja Sex Party <laughs> album now. Sex curricular activity. <laughs> so funny. Are you in heat, Makoto? Don't care what who they are. What the hell is happening? <laughs> Make TikTok later. Don't care who they are as long as they got the right equipment. Watch it, Sakura. Makoto's transformed into a wild beast. Prime Minister Well Beast of Beastopia. Alright, someone needs to die. <laughs> Why is this happening to me? <laughs> Can I talk with you till tomorrow? I'd like to get some rest today. For some reason, I've been feeling worn down these last few days. Huh? Might be that poison you drank. <laughs> yeah. I scarfed out my breakfast as fast as I could and immediately headed back to my room. I threw up a little. <laughs> Barfed him. <laughs> Pooped him. <laughs> <laughs> fucking always gets me, dude. Always gets me. It's such a classic. <laughs> Poop. Poop. Do, do you remember what that's from? Uh, was it a Zelda? No, it's a South Park episode where uh, <laughs> they go to see Rod Stewart in concert, <laughs> and he's like 150 years old, and they wheel about, and the music starts. And it's like, da -da 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 -da. and they put the microphone up to his face, and he goes, Arrgh. poop. So stupid. <laughs> wow, are you all right? You almost fell off your chair. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. It's so I funny. I'll send you that clip. <laughs> oh my god. I'm losing my fucking mind over here. <laughs> you know why? You know why they say... You know... You know why... <laughs> they're called leaves? Yes, sir? <laughs> you know why they're called leaves? Why? Cuz... Uh... Cuz trees are always leaving them on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> was, I, was that a joke? Alright, here's another one. <laughs> Where does, where does England keep their armies? Where? 
in their sleeveies. <laughs> what I really love about sports isn't winning, you know? It's having to fight and struggle and give it all you got to reach the top. That's the excitement. It's that excitement. That fear that you might suffer a heartbreaking loss when you finally reach that goal. It's just lonely. It's lonely at the top, you know? I never really got into sports, so I couldn't really care fucking less about what she's talking about. <laughs> but I could tell that the reason he knew was so amazing and how hard she could fight and struggle. I was fighting and struggling to give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello there, people. <laughs> I don't feel like just sitting here. I should go somewhere. Oh, there's more. Ah. Free time? More free time. Well, you you can uh, you can skip it. Like you can. I think if you click on the bed, it skips the free time. But it's like, why would you do that when you can learn more about these hilarious characters? <laughs> why would you do that? Says the man who just went. Oh God, is there more? <laughs> <laughs> if only I could skip it. Well, you can skip it. Skip it. Oh <laughs> oh oh. <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Stop beating around the bush. Just tell us what you're talking about. Stop beating around the bush. <laughs> My bush. <laughs> well, back you. You've already told everyone how one of you might be working as a spa for me, right? Come on. Yeah, so what about it? Well, today I'd like and to And what does this have to do with my bush? <laughs> well, I'll tell you what it has to do about your bush. Well, today I'd like <laughs> to tell you about that spy. Huh? Hey, uh... So guess what? The spy is actually Sakura Ogami! Holy crap. Uh, uh, uh. I have to take full responsibility for this. However... How do you intend to do that? By destroying the mastermind. What? I... I'm going to challenge them. Even if it means we both go down, I will defeat them. I'm sorry. That's so it. in the end. <laughs> <laughs> go to your room, cool down, take a time out, and we can continue this discussion tomorrow. Have an animal cracker. <laughs> it was the worst. <laughs> the mood at the end of the night was just the worst. I'm starting to think this school isn't so fun. <laughs> Being in such an awful mood, we were honestly glad the day was over. At least I was, and I was projecting on everyone else. <laughs> Sakura is the spy. Sakura the spy. It's like Harriet the spy, but Sakura. <laughs> She's the traitor. Byakuya said Sakura. But not like be. Trader Joe's. <laughs> Oh my god, if Trader Joe's was spelled T-R-A-I-T-A-O-T-O-R, rather. Oh my god. That would be amazing. Damn you, Trader Joe! <laughs> you told like you me get this to the... meat was 50% off! Uh, yeah, you get, to the, you get to the cash register and it's like way more expensive than you were led to believe. I'm worried about Sakura. I need to hurry up and get to the dining hall. Oh no, someone's murdered. <laughs> <laughs> Or the surprise. I, I can feel God. it in their bones. <laughs> when I see that Sakura are on the floor. dead, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. In fact, if she did die, that would settle this entire issue, wouldn't it? <laughs> You're the only would, one with an issue. <laughs> it would put the whole problem to rest. You're the, the problem that the you're problem. creating. <laughs> yeah. What the Ooh. hell? You disgust me. <laughs> you're. You're a monster! To say something like that, it should have been you. Hell yeah. You should have been the one to die! Yes! Damn, Hina! What's wrong? Lost your nerve? Chicken? Bok, 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 bok. <laughs> Without a word, each of us left the dining hall. We headed back to our rooms one by one, and then I murdered Byakuya. Anyway, <laughs> the next day is gonna be good. <laughs> oh, a trial! <laughs> Who? So, what should I do today? I don't want free time. Man, fuck this. <laughs> you just don't see the splendor of the crab. Haven't you ever heard the tale of the crab and the monkey? Of course I've heard of it! I know all about it! But so what? The crab beats the monkey, but it's just some legend. 
hardly relevant to our great obsessed modern society. Sure, monkeys still show up in movies and stuff from time to time, but not crabs. What the fuck are you talking? <laughs> uh, Makoto, we got a big problem, man. Okay, it's not Hero. What's wrong? Look. Hero's finger shook as he pointed. Oh, oh no. shit. H Hina. Are you okay? What happened? She she killed her. What? What? Who I killed who? Killed Hina. But Hina's what? alive. But Hina's not dead. <laughs> She's like, I'm I'm here. No, 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 okay. no, no, she's not dead. Open your ass. No way she's dead. Well, why? What happened? Well, Toko and Hina just all of a sudden they were yelling and then they knocked the pepper off the table. <laughs> and that means someone's dead. <laughs> and it, yeah, and it, I opened the window so it wouldn't be hot anymore. <laughs> but still, that was super close. The pepper fell off the table and you almost died. If I hadn't yelled out, you'd be dead right now. It's all thanks to me, you know. Uh, yeah, well, a thousand thanks to you, sir. So sarcastic. That just makes you sound even more hostile. Okay. I don't think they're gonna end up together. No, not in the end. In the end? <laughs> so in the end. <laughs> I want to keep being helpful to everyone. I want to keep scouring for more p clues. <laughs> I want to work as hard as everyone else so that we can all get out of here. That's what Master would want, too. So to help everyone else to solve the mystery of this school. The only way I can help is if you connect me to the school's network and point me towards you po- uh, <laughs> uh, Hopespeak.com I realize how dangerous it could be, but still, I have to do this. I'm scared, but I can handle it. I need to know if Debbie really does Dallas. Really wow, that's an, that's an old reference, man. Yeah. When I think that's no way to talk about someone's grandma. <laughs> hey, Makoto. Yeah. Before you go into the bathroom and pull out that big honk and wang of yours, <laughs> are you sure all the documents are gone? I'm gonna be really disappointed Makoto. when uh, Alter Ego gets hacked oh, yeah. by Monokuma. Yeah. She, she gets all smashed up. Yeah. Or or, or just Monokuma's face is on the screen. You're like, <laughs> Good. Nine pizzas, huh? Like, I just <laughs> I can see it in my head. Hina just came to see me, and she was white as a ghost. It sounds like something's happened. It's oh a, no, is my- is my boy dead? If it's a murder, just let me sleep a little longer. What? <laughs> <laughs> the door isn't locked. It's not locked because the rec room door doesn't have a lock. Huh? Then how is anyone supposed? then why- Oh crap. If you- yeah, I was just thinking, uh, it feels like the door is pressing up against something inside the room. Is it the chair? Or, or it maybe hero? Hero's dead body? Yeah. yeah. I stuck my hand through the now open window and started jostling the chair leaning against the door. Wait, can we pause for one second, Aaron? Okay. I'm sorry, I'm just getting an important phone call. Okay. One sec. Congratulations, you have one free cruise for two. Okay, sorry about that, man. Yeah, I'm, uh... Pretty fucking livid about it, to be honest with you. <laughs> the chair's pretty heavy, but if I could just... I pushed on it with all my strength, and finally the knob turned. Sakura! Ran up to her as fast as I could, but the moment I laid my hand on her... Oh no, no... Oh, oh is she dead? I don't want her to be dead. No! 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 All I felt was cold Damn it, death. man! Man, she was my favorite character. All star apologies. <laughs> I guess my second favorite um, character is still alive. Who's that? Aoi. Oh yeah, she's awesome. Huh? I, they they really cut away the ones that I wasn't crazy about and and left uh, my favorites. Yeah. I heard Hina talking, <laughs> but my eyes stared steadily forward. I could only look on at Sakura's dead body. Man. We didn't make it in time. Oh, you think, <laughs> Kiri Giri? I'm just gonna call it right now. Okay. Just so, just so uh, that can be on the table for the for the people. You think who you know, know who it is? Going on. I I don't want it to be true, but I think it was okay. Aoi. I really wish this game just punctuated like really dramatic moments with farts, then everyone had to like 
just just like get over it cuz yeah kind of pretend like it didn't happen yeah just like you killed um, Sakura I know it <laughs> yeah <laughs> like they're all actors in a play but they're like, like everyone's kind of softly farting <laughs> The only way into the rec room is the door we just came through. And that door had been jammed shut with a chair from inside the rec room. Which means the killer would have had to escape somehow after barring the door. Maybe she did it to herself. Because she didn't want to cause any Bashed more- herself over the head? Yeah, maybe she- well, maybe she was like stumbling because she was poisoned. I don't know. Like, but she slumped in a chair. I don't know about that. Yeah. Are you curious to hear more about what a locked room murder entails? Yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> when you break down this kind of murder mystery, there are four basic types. Oh! But according to the Monokuma file, she also had vomited blood. And I can see a trace of blood on her lips for sure. So what would have caused her to vomit blood? The Monokuma file specifically said she hadn't suffered any other injuries. Nice. What would cause her to vomit blood? <laughs> Did she watch Mean Girls too? <laughs> Wait, is that even a movie? I don't know. <laughs> it was a movie. Mean Girls 2. It came out in 2011 and has a 31% on Rotten Tomatoes. My joke did make sense. It's no different from your standard ship in a bottle. Huh? Know where the bottle's opening is smaller than the boat placed inside? You've never seen that? Oh, yeah, you man. Uncultured maybe I swine. So, this is the Monokuma version of that. A Monokuma bottle, if you will. Nice. Okay. Wait. Let me see that... again? What? The Let me see that shelf again? The shelf I'm looking at? Yeah, yeah, can you get a closer look? No. One more time? Oh, man. Cause it showed everything and it actually looked like two bottles were missing. Oh. Yeah, I mean, it, it looked... It still does, actually, because... The... The chess pieces are... Pawn, Rook, the Knight one was smashed on the floor, Bishop, blank, and then king, so the queen would be somewhere. There's a second missing bottle, baby. Oh my god. But the fact that she had asked those three to meet with her, and she asked them to come to the rec room at noon, the same time and place she ended up dying. It might be good to confirm what I just heard with the three of them directly. I'm starting to think she didn't intend on dying when she came up here. <laughs> those other two probably went back to their rooms. Oh yeah, Taka. Forgot about him. Makoto. That's yeah. Me. Oh, dude, we've had so many friends that are dead now. <laughs> Junko. God, she didn't get a moment. She didn't even get a yeah. moment. She seemed so important at the beginning. Yeah. While I'm here, could you show me the note she gave you? Um, oh, um, do I still have it? Let's see. Hero was feeling around in his pockets. Ah, uh, sorry, it looks like I don't have it anymore. YOU FUCKING IDIOT! It must, have, <laughs> it must have fallen into an incinerator filled with acid and then had monkeys punch it for a while. <laughs> I try to suck the ass into my dick, and then suck it out of my dick again. But sometimes... It doesn't work. I couldn't hear any of that, Aaron, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello everyone! Welcome back to Game Grumps! It is I, Aaron! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Ding Dang Rimples. Uh, <laughs> that we're we're at the Chem Lab, which actually, I, I'm now looking at it. I wish it was the Hebrew pronunciation of Chem. Chem. <laughs> ah, it's the Chem Lab. <laughs> Want to meet me in the Chem Lab, maybe? <laughs> Just make sure you don't get in my way. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> okay, it's a it's a big room. You should be fine. Yeah. <laughs> I think what you meant to say was, yes, sir. I understand. I hate this guy. <laughs> he is so the worst. He's like fucking light from Death Note. <laughs> it's a, he's not just a he's not just an arrogant prick, but he's also not smart. Like he's he makes the dumbest decisions. Yeah, and I hate how gorgeous he is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <but> he <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> so I got to work, and before long, I drawn up a sketch of the room. It looks just like the fucking room. Like, I don't know. <laughs> how is this helping anyone? Yeah. So the treasure must be buried around here somewhere. <laughs> it's here. Um, so how's this? Not bad. 
For for you. For you. It will be very painful. For me. <laughs> so when you look at it like this, interesting. It's not. It's not. <laughs> it would appear that whoever left these footprints only had business at the leftmost shelf. No, you had to draw a diagram to look at that. I literally pointed that out when I was talking about the <laughs> footprints, you piece of shit. But with how clear these prints are, it should be quite easy to determine who they do belong to. <laughs> then these prints are a really valuable clue. Poof! <laughs> and the, they all disappear. In the <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. I drew the diagram. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Would you like to hear something interesting? Yeah, sure, but <laughs> I'm assuming what you're about to say isn't. Did you know more people die every year from falling coconuts than shark attacks? <laughs> Isn't that interesting? That really is what it, when it happened. It must be related to the case somehow. Of course. What do you mean if it's related to the case somehow? <laughs> <laughs> she was poisoned, and you're in front of the poison thing with poison spilled on the floor. Jesus. Oh my god. Judging see, by the let's... skull and crossbones on the bottle, we can only assume that the buried treasure was within this bottle. <laughs> All the containers on the shelf are labeled with the letter A and a number. So I guess I could consider this part of the shelving unit section A on account of the big fucking A on the goddamn shelf. All the containers on this shelf are labeled with the letter B and number. So I guess I could consider this part of the shelving unit section B also on account of the giant fucking bee on the goddamn shelf! <laughs> mm, I don't see anything out of the ordinary here. But was a bottle of poison from sex to see- I'm, I'm sorry to interrupt. Before you click away. How cute is that skull? <laughs> He's like, hee <laughs> hee like, I'll, I'll kill you. <laughs> you drink this, maybe he'll die. Who knows? <laughs> I'm just a naughty dietary supplement. <laughs> but it's all too convenient. Someone must be lying. Someone's lying. <laughs> well, I've made some progress of my own. <laughs> Seems like you've been doing your due diligence over there. I took the broom and dustpan and got to work collecting all the broken bottle pieces. And I cut myself several times and died at the crime scene. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bled out. Ugh. It's just like a little <laughs> finger wound. Just like bleeding this huge <laughs> pile of blood. Like, uh. <laughs> Kill to think, guys, you're back. Things went horribly awry. <laughs> oh my god, there's so much blood! I know, I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> and, and just <laughs> finished up. Now here comes the important part. Toko is the murderer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the plastic bag must weigh a lot. <laughs> huh? Broken pieces are heavier. Dude, they're using this to say that there were two bottles. They're going these they're jumping through these like thousands of hoops to say that there were two bottles when there were clearly two bottles Whoops, he had caught me sleeping. <laughs> they caught me slipping <laughs> the killer the one that murdered Sakura She was stronger than anyone I know And yet someone killed her Maybe it was herself. Maybe she was the only one strong enough to kill. And that person is here. <laughs> to overtake her own self. <laughs> that person. She is struggled for hours. <laughs> <laughs> a deadly judgment. A deadly deception. A deadly betrayal. A deadly riddle. A deadly defense. A deadly faith. A, a deadly death. <laughs> a deadly sandwich. A deadly soup. A deadly Coke can. <laughs> a deadly wow. A deadly rap. Thanks for coming to Deadly Subway. How may I be your deadly sandwich artist today? <laughs> Why do they call cheating cheating? It's like when you cheat at a game, it's like you're taking like a you're doing something outside of the rules. Oh. <laughs> Did you just answer your own question? Yeah. That's the only reason you have for accusing us? Uh, go oh. <laughs> <laughs> I hate- I hate these things, I'm just gonna say. Oh, come on! Fucking God! Oh! No! Fuck! God damn this one! This one's impossible, dude! The, the wonderful thing she does... What? Oh, shit. Fuck! Fuck! Uh, that's the wrong button! Fuck, 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 fuck! God damn it! Oh my god! Fucking God! <laughs> ah! 
Thank you. There we go. Jesus. Woo. No, you're up. Ding dong, ping pong. Rex. <laughs> <laughs> so there's no way you could have seen it then. Tell us the truth, hero. When did you see the message? Um. Uh, uh, hold on. When I wrote it. <laughs> when I plagiarized it from a, a cake Instagrammer. <laughs> read the Vienna sausage ogre left us and we know who the killer is Toko the Vienna sausage I I do not understand what that means <laughs> I don't, I don't even know. no I absolutely do doubt it there's no way Sakura wrote that message and I know why because she was dead <laughs> so in the end <laughs> oh shit Gotti. show me the proof this should prove it this should prove it! Oh, Words uh, in your uh, face! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That Can somebody move this Hifumi message. picture, please? <laughs> because if you look at it, the message was almost certainly written using a finger. But as we remember, Sakura has no fingers. <laughs> Somebody who's got bloody fingers. Everyone show their fingers. Oh, they're all clean? <laughs> oh, I don't know then. Yeah. That would explain how he knew about the message in the first place. I oh, shit, dude. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what happened. What? Uh-oh. I figured as much. But why would you write something like that? Because because I killed her! What? Because of the wonderful things he does! What, really? Please, just let me explain what happened. Oh, was it an accident? So I headed to the rec room right before noon. Or he thinks he killed her, but he didn't really do it. Oh. Exactly as the note asked. What a fool. Shut up! Shut up! I wish every character just, whenever he said something, everyone just turned to him and was like, Shut up! Shit, just like, like a cacophony of like, Shut the fuck up! Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Yeah. Anyway, just, what like, were we talking about? I'm like, <laughs> you did exactly what a note asked. What a fool. <laughs> ah. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why would you take the time to write that message? Then stick it somewhere we might not find it. Oh. Well, uh... I didn't hide it. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I'm sure, I just left it sitting there on the table. Really? Uh, what? Then somebody who admitted that they tampered with the evidence. He's lying. <laughs> right? He's got to be lying. I don't see any reason he would lie now after already confessing to the crime. Yeah, he's a pretty honest dude all things considered. I killed him. No, you didn't. Uh, I just told you I did. <laughs> I don't doubt Hero attacked Sakura with the body. But that's not where this case ends. What do you mean? What he means is that Hero isn't the killer. Like he Way said, go, Hero. with those exact words. <laughs> My boy's making it to chapter five. <laughs> There's something very suspicious Oh my god, about dude. Can you, like, it's the most obvious shit. <laughs> Once you understand that point, you'll understand why two separate Monokuma bottles There's something the suspicious about this that has to do with two Monokuma bottles. Hmm. I'd like to raise a question. <laughs> I believe the footprints were left by someone's feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like no, you're wrong! Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> uh, there are four uh, Monokuma bottles. Joke. Of a bottle on the ground, along with the chess piece it had inside. That was the bottle Hero hit Sakura with, right? Uh huh. For now, just note that there were four intact bottles and one broken bottle. Are we seriously still not coming to the conclusion that there were two bottles? If you look at what the bottles all had in common, it should become. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> what did the two? The queen guys in chess pieces! That's right, kids. The chess pieces. It's like those puzzles for preschoolers where, like, there's only two pieces and one is a background and the other is a bear in the middle of the background. You know what I mean? Yeah, what is different about these two pictures? And the puzzle piece that's missing is the bear. <laughs> so the queen is missing. Very good. 
I really. And Toku's my queen. <laughs> so... I I really wonder how much actual time was spent on this conversation when they could have just been like, "There's clearly two bottles." There were two yeah. bottles. <laughs> I love it. I, I've I've. I used to hate it, and now I think I'm growing to love it. The, it's part uh, of this game's charm. It's charming. Oh, she's losing it. She did it. Yeah, damn. No, it's not ridiculous at all. I need proof that shows Toko was hiding in the rec room, and I have it. She left it there for anyone to find. Her tiny hands left tiny handprints. <laughs> and we'll find out what they are. Next time on Game Grow. Oh! Yeah! Oh man, I like the way this is going now. Got another confession to make. I killed I've Sakura. Got ten of hands. <laughs> there oh, you <man>. go. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Dingley Rimpleys. Uh, lock her handprint. Lock her handprint. This should prove it. <sighs> Wait, there was a locker handprint? Yeah, there was handprints on the locker. Oh, I forgot about that. Stop wasting my time. Just tell us the truth. Oh my god, you're still here? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I've on. solved this case. <laughs> Dang, she just straight up admitted it. Well, I mean, you straight yeah, who up admitted would do that, and murdered somebody. Dumbass. <laughs> you wasn't about to die for some woman? If I'm gonna go down, I want it to be for killing Master. Just Hell yeah. <laughs> You know what? You know what, Genocide Jill? You're all right. <laughs> as long as you take out Byakuya, all is forgiven. <laughs> but anyway, I'm not the one that killed Ogre. So that's good. Yeah, Hell calling yeah. her Ogre isn't helping your case, dude. <laughs> yeah. So that's good. Keep talking like that and Hina's gonna... Huh? I thought for sure you'd have some words for Hero on that one. Oh my god, it is Hina. It was fucking Hina. Oh my god, I was right the first oh time. Oh my god, what? Oh, the misdirection. No way. Even before we open the door to the rec room, Hina and I both gotta look inside. Oh, excuse me, god. And at that point, the locker was already open. That's <gasps> right. So obviously, Toko could Airing out all of Toko's farts. I didn't fart! Genocide Jill farted! Yeah. I too! Yeah! I farted! I have proof that you farted! It's right here! Objection! No, you're wrong! I've been saying all along, there's still more to this case. Just say it then, you dickbag. That means Ogre didn't die from the shot to the head. And... And... And shut up! Just shut up! Shut up! <laughs> or better than shutting up, say the thing. What if everybody murders Byakuya all at once? Do they all get to graduate? Not to mention, I didn't find any cuts inside her mouth. Oh, did you look inside her and mouth, believe Kyoko? Me, I got all up in there. <laughs> yeah. Kyoko's a, an interesting person. <laughs> what do you think these gloves are for? <laughs> no, I'm not into dead bodies. When I performed the routine <laughs> corpse colonoscopy, <laughs> I found nothing. Yeah. Don't even get me started on her butthole. And that's where I found this. Is that the poison? Wow. Way to not bring poison, attention and suspicion to yourself by carrying the poison that she yeah. died from. And I found this used, already used bottle of Chem C9. It already had my fingerprints all over it, so I figured I'd take it anyway. I happen to know exactly what happens to a victim when they ingest this stuff. In section A, dietary supplements. In B, reagents. And in C, a variety of lethal chemicals. They stand for three very important words. Abracadabra, Babracadabra, <laughs> and Cabracadabra. <laughs> and just Cadabra. <laughs> Abracadabra, Bracadabra, and Cadabra. <laughs> yeah. Cadabra by itself is poison. Unless there's Bucadabra to reagent, uh. <laughs> Makes me want to spit it out. What's so high quality about this stuff? 
What a badass! <laughs> I'm talking about the protein, of course. Protein? Uh? Can I see that bottle for a second? Uh, sure. Do whatever you like. Yes. It says so you're going jism to need me to regurgitate what I just drank. <laughs> Protein drank? <laughs> <laughs> Give me that purple drank! <laughs> well done. Now I understand. Now I get it! I didn't before, but when in my mind it was like a like a game of hangman and there were numbers yeah, I just and letters. Play hangman's gambit for a second. <laughs> like he comes out of it, everyone's left. <laughs> Once you accept that, it becomes obvious how the culprit was able to get Sakura to drink the poison. Right. <laughs> it must have been in the bottle I hit her over the head with, and the poison went into her head via osmosis. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The Very boomerang good, method! <laughs> <laughs> That's all it took to kill Sakura. That is the true cause of death. Yeah, everyone was like whacking her over the head and they thought like, oh, I yeah, killed her and I killed so her. It's so funny. <laughs> every, every innocent person in this room just bashed her over the head with the nearest <laughs> object. Yeah, so you're all fine. Everybody's fine. Don't worry. I know you all had the intent to kill her, but... That's the evidence you're talking about, isn't it? Um, sure. <laughs> Good job, idiot. But then I came later and there was footprints. <laughs> Which leads me to believe that somebody was standing there and walking. And what I found there was one single footprint. <laughs> About eight to be exact. Suppose we could have done that right at the top of the trial. But yeah, well, it's fine. The Damn, Hina. I I How many people are going to confess to this murder? Damn. Man, I should have stuck to my guns on this one. Wow. At least, at least I'll get the satisfaction of the comments of that particular episode being like, Holy shit, Aaron Calder, what the fuck? Look at Monokuma in the background like, <gasps> <laughs> That's when you switched out the protein powder, and that's when you gave her the poisoned mixture. And then, she downed it. All at once. And, and then, hold it. I'm not convinced. Whoa. Not what? Claim she wouldn't kill a close friend, are you? You still don't get it, do you? The game we're playing here isn't so kind. I swear to God, if it's not Hina, I'm gonna lose my mind. What matters is outwitting. Oh my God, it's fucking Biakia. Do you honestly think Hina didn't actually kill her? And if I do? Well then, um, <laughs> nuts I mean, to that. We're running out of people. <laughs> What's the meaning of this? Uh, um, well, you lied to us. Plain and simple. Like a bagel. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, thanks, Kyoko. Anyway. <laughs> what the hell? What's going on here? Oh, what's yeah, yeah. Oh, dear. Wow. 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 Footprints aren't the only problem with her account. Before I explain that part, I'd like to submit some new evidence. Oh shit. Oh damn. <laughs> it's this... <laughs> it's this <laughs> boombox. It plays all the greatest hits of 1988 on cassette. <laughs> it's gonna be like, it's this macaroni art that I made earlier. <laughs> Isn't it great? Do you like it? It's all of us holding hands. <laughs> I found this. Huh? A piece of glass? To the bottom of the bottle. And the hidden clue was exposed. Thanks to you ingesting the powder. I oh, dip. And probably some more glass. So, so good luck, your <laughs> intestines. <laughs> but, what is it? Oh, you still don't realize? Well then, Makoto, why don't you explain it? Huh? Oh, shit! <laughs> 
earlier when you asked if anyone had moved the can or tripped over it. If that were the case, that would explain the can being on top of the glass. So you asked everyone about it to eliminate that possibility right out of the gate. And that's made everything clear, hasn't it? <laughs> yeah, I guess I'm he, pretty yeah, fucking awesome. He, hero busts in. Yes, of course! Sakura killed herself! <laughs> and everyone's like, what? No. I thought we all agreed she was tricked into drinking it because of the protein can. No, that's not why. The only explanation is she drank it from its original bottle, knowing exactly what it was. Precisely. She was alone in a locked room. All she had was the poison. What Whoa. other possibility is there? You're saying she drank it? Knowing what it was? Such a ridiculous fiction is exactly what happened. What? Then tell us already. Er, sorry. Please tell us. Oh wow, was that humility from Byakuya? Yeah, yeah. Say this is actually a good groove. Wrong! You're wrong! I'm telling you, I did it! Stop talking! Damn, Aaron, you're incredible! Okay, um, Do you have any kind of proof Sakura took the poison? Yes. Yellow powder. This should prove it. This should prove it. <laughs> that powder was yellow, wasn't it? So the powder we found on Sakura. I, I don't know. I, I'm colorblind. Everyone's like, you're, from the chem lab. you're colorblind? <laughs> <laughs> You've gotten this far with all of these color related things and you're colorblind? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. I just trusted everyone else. <laughs> Why is Hina lying about all this shit? Yeah, I don't get it. And when Sakura dropped the bottle, she dropped it away from where she was actually standing, which is how she was able to avoid getting it all over herself. But the powder still got scattered around, and some of it must have wound up on her instep. Right. Is there any problem with my thinking? <laughs> I think good. Is there any problem with me thinks? <laughs> if so, call 1 800 I don't give a flying shit, so fuck you. <laughs> Dot com! <laughs> <laughs> the one that killed Sakura. The connection between Sakura and the poison, the unsolved mystery of the locked room. There's only one way to explain it. It was. It was Sakura. Yeah, I think so. Here's my answer. The one who killed Sakura was Sakura. Okay, I called that earlier than Hina. I just want to say Damn. that. Damn. What? What? The killer was Sakura? Wait, so you're saying- She must be executed! <laughs> yeah. What kind of punishment do you have to set aside for her, Monokuma? So you're saying Hina consciously deceived us to make it look like she killed Sakura? Because she's the ultimate friend. You all thought she was a murderer, but in fact, she was the best not murderer of all. Yeah. In fact, she was willing to accuse you all of murder to protect her other, her dead friend. So I guess she's... I guess how good a friend she is is really dependent on which one of you you are. That's enough, Hina. It's over. And also... I know you didn't accuse me, so like, it's, we're cool. We're still cool. Yeah, 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 yeah you, you know. Actually, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I'd like to introduce 40 more pieces of new evidence. If this game could be summed up in three lines of dialogue. <laughs> it's over. It's, it's not over! Yes, it is! Actually, no, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen everybody. I'm not even gonna pretend. I'm just fucking using a walkthrough for this. <laughs> Oh, all right. Cause it's it's so con there's so many pictures that are like kind of the same, and it just uh, I don't know. I just I just have such okay. trouble with it. She jumped out of the locker and hid the magazine on the shelf with all the others. Okay. But she hung upside down like Spider Man, so she was confused. She put the magazine back upside down. That's when Bianca came came inside and they kissed upside down like a spider. Ha ha ha! Just like Hero, she grabbed another Monokuma bottle and attacked her. 
You know, for the ultimate martial arts champion, soccer sure took a lot of shots to the head. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> From a bunch of tiny little skinny people. From a bunch people. of noobs, <laughs> yeah. She gathered up the broken Monokuma bottle shards and the queen chess piece. And that Act 5. <laughs> Flashboard. Act 378. <laughs> That's when Godzilla came in. <laughs> they did all this specifically to place all the suspicion on themselves in an attempt to guide the trial to a false conclusion. And the one who went to all that effort. <laughs> Why? A lot of strange motivations in this murder. <laughs> yeah, and like, why is that Makoto art so like, ah, oh, farted into the wind? <laughs> like, it's, it's so dramatic. It's, it's raining on my face. <laughs> we don't all act according to calculations and cost-benefit diagrams. That's what makes us so complicated. That's what you don't understand. And that's why you couldn't solve this case. <laughs> yeah. You don't have Good. humanity in you, unlike me, who has 1% humanity in me. See, didn't I tell you? <laughs> when you dismiss other people's feelings, it'll always come back to bite you in the end. I'm feeling rage right now, does that count? <laughs> yeah. Feeling like murdering you all. What's the punishment gonna be? I don't know. They just- it's just the huh. rules. Okay. Sakura, Sakura, Sakura? <laughs> Mazel tov! And the punishment is... We're bringing her back to life! <laughs> like, what? Huh? And then death. <laughs> Such brutality has made me desperate, so instead of just waiting to be killed, I'll do it by my own hand. Th that's... I found it on the ground in front of the rec room! It's Sakura's suicide note! Really would've sped up this whole process, wouldn't it? <laughs> if I just brought this as evidence! <laughs> Listen, don't do it! <laughs> Don't you do it! If they all gang up on you at once, even you! Hina. Hina. First of all, I would destroy each and every one of them. Do you know how ripped I am? Second of I all, would pop them like grapes! <laughs> Sakura died hating all of us. I wanted to free her of her regrets. But even that got found out in the end. It doesn't even matter! <laughs> I could never face her after all this. Hey! Hey! Well, you won't have to. Yeah. <laughs> what am I gonna do? I have to talk to her next week. <laughs> <laughs> what if it was really like this? What is that? Of course. Isn't it obvious? Yep. It's a forged letter. <laughs> a suicide note. Soccer a suicide note. Well, what? But he know already. Oh, I wrote that one. It was all me, baby. Dang. This is the one Sakura addressed to Hina and put in her room. This. Fucking bear. Yeah. What? Then you lied to me? Monokuma? What? You lied to me? My good friend Hina, there's <laughs> something I have to tell you. I hate to do it like this, but you need to know. You know I had to do it to him. <laughs> then it's a picture of her in that fucking the Tampa driveway. <laughs> the, the, yeah, the khakis. <laughs> if the mastermind demands that I kill someone, then that someone will be me! Then my dojo will be safe, and above all else, none of you will have to kill anyone. Except for the next murder that happens. <laughs> right. When I die, the source of conflict among you all dies with me. For that, I'm willing to give up my life. If it can save you, then sacrificing my own life could have no greater meaning. Man, Sakura is... She's, she's a good lady. Dude, she stole my fave. My this game is doing me a heckin' concern. I can't tell anyone about my plan while I'm alive, but I wanted you to understand why I'm doing this. In the end, though, I- She wrote all this on that one sheet of paper? So in the end. <laughs> yeah, seriously. In the end, though, I hope to show myself through actions and not words. Hopefully then they'll see- I never saw you as my enemy. You were only ever my friend. Oh. Who I wanted to help as much as possible. Hina. Yeah, she starts yeah, writing at the top all big, and then it <laughs> gets smaller and smaller. <laughs> it's like, it's all squished up. longer than I thought it would be, sorry. <laughs> yeah. And then it says over with a little arrow, <laughs> telling you to flip the page. No matter what. <laughs> it kind of curves, the word like curves <laughs> down. Yeah, yeah, the word curves down the side, totally. <laughs> We're not enemies that hate each other, except for maybe Byakuya. We're friends, we need to work together! Except for maybe Byakuya. You know? 
Damn straight. This is all because of our misplaced hatred. Well? I don't blame her, I can't blame her, and nobody can blame Hina either. You know, a good place to start would be to stop calling her Ogre. This is a life or death elimination match. The only way to survive is to win. There can be no doubt that those are the rules of the game. Hmm. Which is why I'm bowing out of the game. Damn! 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 <laughs> Sakura and Hina were both willing to sacrifice their own lives to deny the reality of the game. Thanks to them, it would appear that the others have cast aside their fear for this game. Don't make me repeat myself. There's no point in participating in a game which has lost that sense of excitement. Which is why I will no longer be participating in it. I mean, you weren't really participating to begin with. You didn't kill anyone. Yeah, I mean, you've been kind of weird. What? Oh, what's going on here? Now I have only one thing to look forward to. Dance class at nine. <laughs> and that is to heap the harshest possible punishment onto the one who thinks they can control me. Oh, damn. B B is he turning baby face? So for my special punishment, I've prepared a special guest. A uh, special guest? Okay. What the hell is gonna happen? I have no idea. Oh, it's Alter Ego. N oh no, not Alter Ego! <laughs> um... Oh, that's so sad! <laughs> what did Alter Ego ever do to anybody? <laughs> well, she tried to hack into the system. Oh, yeah. Mmm, this sucks. <laughs> I'm just a computer, so it's like, whatever. Yeah, this raises a lot of questions about AI rights. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure someday we'll have a big oh. conversation about it in 2060 or whatever. Yep, excavator destroyer! Oh! Ow, 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 ow. It doesn't really hurt. I'm a computer. <laughs> Damn. This is messed up. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> look at his floppy. I can't stay mad at him. <laughs> it's just a floppy little bear. And there we go. Oh. Oh, he like... Sculpted it into a little ball, huh? Yeah, it's kind of beautiful. What a great dude. He's an artist really Real cool Real cool Monokuma. Yeah. What did the mastermind do to us? Are we all Avril Lavigne style clones? I Mean Wait, what Avril Lavigne has clones? Yeah, of course Avril Lavigne died right after complicated and she was replaced by a clone Didn't you know that is that right? Yeah, yeah, of course everybody knows that that sounds like a really, 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 really smart theory. Yes, I agree. You mean to tell me that my favorite Avril Lavigne song, Hello Kitty, was written after she died and made by a clone? Well, I mean, the clone doesn't write the music, Dan. The clone- the- the producer writes the music. The clone just performs it. Lip syncs it, really. Oh. Alright, that I can see. Yeah. Because the clone doesn't actually sound like Avril Lavigne. That would be ridiculous. Uh, they have- Just kidding. This is stupid. <laughs> <gasps> Kyoko. <gasps> Kyoko. Romance? Finally romance? Yes, it's me. Is this the dating sim we've all waited for? I don't think so. Why are you out here making a racket? Because the whistles go, whoa! Kyoko! <laughs> you now you too? Whatever! The two of you just get back to bed. I'm positively exhausted from the class trial. That's true. Sure, you got it. Come on, Makoto, let's head back. Together, holding hands. Really? Yeah, that's nice. She woke me up, made me go to the data center, which just so happened to be locked. And then she shows up late and we leave without checking a single thing. What was the point of all that? I thought we were gonna make out! <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, okay then. <laughs> Figured that would be the end of our conversation, just like always, but... Bye. Well then, good night. Sure. And then that was over. Very informative. But as I yeah. turned to leave... <gasps> Mukuro Ikusaba. What? Uh... Mukuro Ikusaba! <laughs> <laughs> Kyoko was right next to me once again, whispering into my Mukuro ear. Ikusaba. Oh! The 16th student, lying hidden somewhere in this school. The one that the ultimate despair. Um... Is that the Watch person out. who conked you over the head? Probably. Watch out for her. What the what the wow. what? Wow. What the what? She's an awesome detective, man. She knows stuff. Yeah, but she doesn't tell it to anybody. 
Mm. Boop. Seven. Ooh, did you see the new appearance? Yeah. To be continued. Oh, <laughs> goodness me.